Hello. I'm very early, yeah. I'm very like, extraordinarily early by like an hour. <laughs> Hi, everybody. What the fuck, dude? I was making food and now you're live and I can't even make my food anymore. No, you can. You can. We're, we're gonna hang out. We're just gonna chill for like a few minutes. You've got time to, to microwave the hot pocket. What do they take? Two minutes? You're not making like spaghetti and meatballs or something, are you? I mean, that takes a long time. That takes like an hour or two. <laughs> I can't even read this. It's it's too fast. This is the it's too fast. I can't even read it. It's too fast. Uh Germa, hi. Hey, how are you? Germa sucks. Hey! Hey! Happy New Year, yeah, happy well not yet. Not yet. Uh, I figured I would start a little early just because I was thinking about it. And if I started at 6 30, because I want to hit Eastern time, right? Like the New York City, that's when the ball drops. The big ball in New York City, right? Uh, I want to hit Eastern time. So that's only like two out, what? 6 30, 7 30, 8 9 30, 10 30, 11 30. That's only two and a half hours. This, we got 19 categories to go through and an entire Rumble card. So, this might be a little longer than I initially anticipated, so let's start early. Get going. I can't even count these subscribers. Oh my god. Five! I can count them. <laughs> this- alright, the number just jumped up. Anyways, let's just hang out for a little bit. I've got all the categories, got everything ready to go. And I- hey! I- how we doing? Got the suit on. Oh, oops. Happy New Year. He's got a 20 year old suit on. <laughs> Shit. Uh, anyways, hi. Happy New Year, guys. <laughs> I, I can't be trusted with a camera. Don't, you cannot trust me with a camera on. Anyways, uh, we got a lot to do. Happy, I mean, can you see it? Happy New Year? It has lights on it, but they don't work. So, I, the battery's like died or something. I don't know. You press a button in there and it lights up the LEDs, but I, whatever. Uh... He's transforming. No, and the shelf is right there, too. That was, like, in per- And I got, like, a fucking suit on? Anyways. Uh, we've got the rumble to do. There are almost- And Stan, listen to this. There are almost 40 characters in this rumble. 40. A lot. Before we even get started. I gotta thank a few people. I gotta thank Kroski Nail, Leather Jacket, VR Josh, CAD BTTV, Grump Clump, and all the other mods. Without their help, this stream does not happen. Like, without their help at all. It just, this physically would not happen, so. They worked on characters, they helped with, like, the poll and shit, like, it's, this doesn't happen unless they helped. So, please give them a round of fucking applause. The stream isn't loading. What? Ban them all. You look sexy as fuck. Ow! I just like popped my shoulder. That like fucking hurt. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> like I'm falling apart. Whatever. Uh, so we can get started. I mean, actually, no, let's just wait. Let's just wait. Can you pog? Is that good enough? It comes a four month break, Fedora. Uh, we have, I'll tell you, with the first category coming up, I'll show you. It's gonna be this one. 
Best new character. That's the first. We're not doing it yet. Hold on. I'm going to milk this. Uh, not f really flashy this year. These are just on security envelopes. Written in crayon, and I spelt the and I spelt it wrong. Off to a great start. <laughs> all right, listen to me. I, I I'm drinking a CBD drink. All right, it's CBD THC. I, I'm me and alcohol. I don't want any alcohol. I spelled character wrong, but I, you know, I knew it. I didn't even care because I didn't want to make a new envelope. So I was just like, what if I don't want to cross that out? I don't care. Uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, people are giving a shitload of subs. What do we got here? Oh, and also uh, Super Daza making fucking all these videos. It's a shitload of videos, it's like 19 videos. So unbelievable work. We had 10 community subs from Lexi's, 5 from Cast Tax, 5 from Hole of One Zombie, $50, $50 from... <laughs> Am I, I'm a 10K Andy now? Yeah, whatever. You know, I want to do the thing. Uh, $50 hair. I put a little gel in it today. And that's a lie, I didn't. Uh, there's so many community subs coming in. I don't know what to do. Uh, thank you for the insane amount of support. Completely unnecessary. Don't have to do this. You guys give me fucking trillions of dollars. With an asterisk. There's an asterisk on that because it's not actually trillions. But, you know, it's there's an asterisk. It's actually like, it's not that much. But it is a lot. It's not over a trillion, though. If it was, I would, I would buy a fucking island and make videos on it. You're the richest streamer on Twitch. That's not true. Well, gonna need to pay up that debt somehow. I don't like this. I don't like where this is. I'm moving it. No, I don't like where that is. It's gonna keep hitting my CBD drink. I don't like this. It's gonna keep bumping into my drink. Whatever. I'm gonna have to... Oh, I'll put the drink over here. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's fill it up. Drinking bong water. All right, so you we wonder how this is going to work? This is how this is going to work. We're going to do four categories, and then we're going to do a match in the Rumble. After a match, we're going to do four categories, match, four categories, match, four categories, match, and we'll be done. So, you ready? Are we, are, are, have we all joined? Is everybody here and accounted for? Everybody pogging? I'm getting lots of pogs. Thank you for the insane community subs, guys. I don't even know where to start. Thank you. You ready? Well, if we're ready, I gotta put my headphones in. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Let's go, they said. You didn't you can't even hear that. Let's go, they said. And the winner of best new character. I didn't even show the nominees yet. Relax. What if I just started reading out all the answers? Uh, you ready? Welcome to the stream. Happy New Year, everybody. Let's uh, take a look at the nominees for best new character. There was a couple of good ones this year. See you in a minute. Cow's name, by the way, is Murius. If you were not part of the pre-stream chat. <laughs> Psycho. And unfortunately, the voice actor from Frog Detective 1 would, did not move on to Frog Detective 2. He was in the middle of other projects. All right, you want, you want me to mute his sections? And I, I, hold on. I, I know that voice actor. Do you want me to call him? Come on. 
Hello? Hey, what's up? It's me. Oh, hey, what's going on? How are you doing? I'm doing good. Did you get my messages that I sent you? Yes, I did. It's the green, more like it. That's me. Yeah, I am invincible. I am untouchable. No one can fuck with Mr. Green. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I spewed a shot out of my mouth. Steve. Yes, Mr. Green. Give me those t-shirts. Oh, my God. Yeah, and when, when you guys come back, remember, it's me, the fat fuck IRL. Come back next week, and I'll shake my stomach around for you more after drinking three Gatorades. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Juggles the Great. Same character. 140th <laughs> stream of his career. This is going to be a good one. Hope you're all ready. <laughs> Same okay. guy. Just one of them's drunker. <laughs> oh, you want some DMT, dude? All right, you got it. I'll take some right now. Holy shit. Holy shit. I think the clerk at my local Walmart is actually Jesus Reborn. And here are 200 reasons why. Hey, whoa, man, whoa, man, you gotta settle down on the DMT. Like, I'm asking because, like, a friend of mine asked me one day, like, a, a yesterday, he said, Hey, dude, what's the button combination if you have, uh, like, a, a computer and you have a program on your computer that emulates video games? He's like, hey, what's the button combination to save a state? And I was like, I don't fucking know. Leave me alone. Dave's pissed. Dave's like a wicked powerful senator. If I get this wrong, they'll, like, introduce a bill to remove my fucking stream. Hey, uh, Jeremy, I got really, uh, my, my, my aspect ratio in Swordfish 1, 2 is going crazy. Fix it. Okay, I think, uh, four, is four by three. I think that will help <laughs> if you do, if you open up that program. It's all right, I'll try. <laughs> They're all just like, fuck. I spy with my little eye <laughs> something that guy. is orange. <laughs> You got it! That's my son! He got it! It's the sky and everything else! You got it! Hey! Same guy four times! <laughs> Try to keep my eye on the road, son! Yellow Power Raid! What's up? <laughs> son, we got a problem here! Son of Tut! <laughs> So, uh, the best new character of the year, if you couldn't differentiate between the four of them that were on the list, is, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, hey, the winner is, with over 50.9% of the vote, Mr. Green. Mr. Green at number one with 50, almost 51% of the vote. Uh, Long Drive Dad was number two at 16.6% .6 of the vote. And I got too lazy to write the third one on this one. It was the first one. Sorry about that. He, he destroyed it, but they're all the same fucking character. They're all the same character. And you know what? Hearing it and seeing it in, while I'm sitting here. <laughs> you ready? Here you go. Hey, I, I do it, everybody. It's, that's me. Every character the German does, that's a little bit weird and might be a little fat. You know, if, if, you, if, you, uh, if you gain some weight and you talk like this and you have like a beard, uh, then all of a sudden all of you, you're like a bad guy. <laughs> I, 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 I got to tell you something else about that, Goku. Dutch, but, but fuck that. They're all the same. It's, they're all the same anyways. We already went over this. That was fucking funny. Anyways, uh, congratulations to Mr. Green. It was way louder than I thought it was going to be on the microphone. I'm sorry. 
All right, coming up next, this is going to I this is my favorite category of the night, can I just tell you? This is my favorite category. Coming up next, we have best cat puke. If you don't know what the cat puke is, uh, a year or two ago, I think it was last year, uh, I, I did a noise, and I, I kind of do a noise sometimes where I'd like pretend to throw up in my mouth and swallow it really quickly. I've done it like probably 30 times in the last two years, and um, I don't know. I don't know why I do it. I just think it's funny. So here's a compilation. This is this is uh, this is the best one of this year, apparently. And I di I didn't even realize how many nominees were on this list. I I do this too much, but I I, I don't care. I'm going to continue to do it. So that's that's just the way it is. Ladies and gentlemen, here come the nominees for best cat puke of the year. This is a water tank. What? You have to make the noise now. No, I can't. I... Finally, a free drink. What? There we go. Come on, I can do it. Come on. One more, just one more for the road. <sighs> I Uh, this that was my favorite category ladies and gentlemen the winner of best cat puke for 2020 oh it's i don't even know which one this was i forgot already it is one more for the road from bug snacks at 20.09 percent of the vote underneath that is the water tank with 15.5 percent and then underneath that one is trying to stop the water at 14.4.6 percent Now, you might be asking yourself, why is that category on the list? Hey, there ain't no worse Peter this year. I can say Peter as much as I want now. I can say Peter. Every, I can say it as much as I want. It's not even, it's not on the list. It wasn't a category. Replaced it with something even worse. All right, this next one is, uh, this next one is going to be very, very fun for you, not for me. Let's take a look at it now. What do you think? See? I'm a human. I'm a normal guy. This is what my hair looks like. Sometimes uh, it doesn't look very good. Sometimes it looks awful. Sometimes it looks so bad that I, it, I'm embarrassed. And a lot of people keep track of these. And every year, we try to find the worst case of bad hair that I've had for the entire year. And there, I think this year, out of all the years, I think this is the worst year ever. For this category. I think there were so many good ones that this was tough. This was a tough one. Here are the nominees. Worst hair of the year. My, my, my looks are over. It's over. It's over. It's, it's over. 
I can't get a fucking haircut right now, guys. Do you understand? I didn't get a haircut in fucking February. And you look like Hillary, Hillary Clinton hair? Hillary Clinton hair? Hairline check. Looks all right. How is that even nominated? single fucking screen. There's just sand outside. And I just, I'm like, all right, I'm done with the broadcast today. It's been swell. Okay, good night, everybody. And then 12 hours go by. Oh! This overexposed camera too. Hey, who, who ordered the pizza? Who ordered the bird's nest? <clears throat> okay, so. Uh, those are the nominees. Uh, I don't I don't think I really even have to... Uh, we don't even need a drum roll. Um, I don't... Do I really need to tell you guys what the worst one was? Do you really not know? Should we even put it? I mean, I guess uh, for sure. Um, but it's the it's the worst hair I've ever had in my life. Not just this year. It's the worst hair ever in my entire childhood, all through my adult life. It's the worst hair I've ever had. Uh, with 44.6% of the vote, the winner. My career is over. When I took... The uh, headband down. My career is over with 44.6% of the vote. In second place was the mop comb over, which was the one that was all that one was gross. Uh, that was 19.14% of the vote. And then in third place was Hillary Clinton at 13.9% of the vote. So there you go. Hillary got robbed. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. Oh, it's, I, I'm sorry. I am sorry, but 45... Look at this. Wait, what? Hey! <laughs> so fucking bad, guys. Like, Hillary Clinton was... Uh, my career is over. My, my, my looks are over. Oh, my career was over. My career was over right there. But I built it back. Uh, yeah, that was that, that. There's no question. You look 60. I looked 600. Like I was mummified and they found me buried. In like a tomb somewhere. What's this next one? Oh, all right. So we're going to stay on this cat. We're going right, to, we've, we've, we've got four. This is the fourth, right? Uh, staying in the same realm of worst hair. We have worst face. And I held this up last year and it went like this. And pe people have tried to nominate that, but I'm sorry, that was not even a bad face. So we're going to do, uh, this is, we need real worst faces. And what is a worst face if you don't, if you're new to the channel or something? Uh, well, sometimes when I go like this, like if I'm scared at a video game or if there's something bad happens or something scary or something weird or I, I'm losing my mind and I, I go like this, like, like, you know what I mean? Or I like freak out and like my, I cringe up and stuff. Uh, or it's just like somebody decides that I was ugly today, and they take a screenshot of me. <laughs> You're in the nominees for worst face of the year. See you in a sec. <laughs> oh no 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 too big too big and too bright too big and too bright too big and too bright That's the worst face 2020 Oh yeah you sure?
How about now? That was pretty bad. No, th is this weird? Is this gonna get like fucking weird? If I'm like. <laughs> Not even that bad. <laughs> this is what a toddler does when they know they did something wrong. That should be an emote. <laughs> Stanley Kubrick. Kubrick stare. <laughs> it's fucking dark in here. So we were just sitting there, and you're just spinning the thing around like, all right, we win, we did it. <laughs> what? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Jeff, Jeff, one, two, go, so go, go. <laughs> My God! <laughs> Boom! That's when I get exposed. Holy shit! Hi. Uh, so the winner of the worst face of the year category. This was a. Uh, it, eh, it wasn't that close. It was. It really wasn't that close. The winner. What do you think? What do you think? With 28.8% of the vote. Who's the easy bake oven pizza face? Oven tea. Coming in next at 14.7% was the Kubrick stare. And then the wide grin was for 10.2% of the vote. Goblin got snubbed. Pretty hard, yeah. I mean, that—I mean, the easy big oven uh, pizza tea thing. That I mean, it was—it revol was revolting. It was disgusting. That was what lost by the most. Um, I don't think that's fair to that nominee. I don't think that's fair to that nominee. And hey, what time is it? We got a rumble. We've got multiple matches. Hopefully, uh, 2K20 does not, uh, fuck up on us. I would be very disappointed if it does. But, uh, I'm ready to start, uh, the first match of the Rumble. We have five matches, including the Rumble. We're gonna be starting with this one first. Uh, just give me one second while I get it going, and we'll get it on. The first match of the Rumble... ...is coming in! Hold on, I don't want to, I don't want to spoil it. I don't want to spoil it. I don't want to spoil it. Ow! <laughs> I'm okay. You thought just the New Year's Eve Awards was the only thing we were doing here. Of course, we're going to do the Gerba Rumble live. In beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. Also where I've been standing. Tried to make an official Germa Arena. Uh, but the game crashed every time I tried to change the rope. Whoa! Don't want to spoil anything. Uh, the game crashed every time I changed the color of the ropes. I couldn't do my own arena. 2K20 is horrible. All right, you ready for the first match? This one's, I, yeah, I think a lot of you guys are going to have a lot riding on this one. You guys are going to have a lot riding on this one. This is a tornado tag match. And this is, it's going to get heated in the chat here. 2v2. While it loads. We're going to have. Turn on predictions. Oh, shit. I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready for it. I'm not ready for it. I'm not ready for it. Any, is there any mods that can help me? I'm not ready for it. I don't know what to do. I'm not ready for it. Any mods that can help me? I'm not ready for it. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Um, oh fuck. Well, you demodded me. I'm- I'm sorry! <laughs> no, I need to be- uh, <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> Shit! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Is that something that we can easily do? 
Can we easily do that? Uh, is, what? Yes, yes, yes. Can we? Mod, 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 mod everyone. <laughs> Uh, how come this is not loading? Tell us the characters in Discord. Tell us the characters. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Good, 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 good. Yeah, 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 yeah. I need my Discord. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. There we go. All right, they have the first match. How come I can't? Why is this not loading? Wait, I didn't just like play the game, did I? I hope I'm not playing the game. The first match of the evening is going to be a tag oh, team match. Hey, I'm talking. Four, one fall. I'm talking. And from New York. <laughs> <laughs> They're all from New York. <laughs> I'm gonna have to turn. The, it's gonna be Kiryu and Majima in a tag match versus two other characters. And by the way, this is a stipulation on this one. Stipulation on this one. Whoever wins this match gets another stream. Really important to mention. As Majima comes in, his tag partner will be coming in too. Kiryu, you, as you know, from Yakuza. Yakuza Zero, to be exact. And from Gotta New shut York, this guy up. In also from New York. Pounds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why does it say you suck? <laughs> I, I think, uh, by the way, I gave him Andre the Giant's entrance. I think that's why he's walking so slow. <laughs> They're all from the Bronx. They're all from Brooklyn. <laughs> I don't think we can even do the betting right now. I like didn't set it up. It's all right. You do it later. Do it on. Do it on uh, betting. On, uh, but who are they fighting against, though? That's important. Who are they going to fight against? Who who would deserve another stream? What do you guys think? There are two characters I know that people are really, really would love to see come back. It's not Bug Snacks. Not God Hand. Not L.A. Noir. Two beloved characters. You see one of them right now. The lights have just turned off. Introducing for the second team of the Who Gets Another and Stream match, it's Sam and Max. York, weighing in at 200 pounds, Sam. I know a lot of you guys got stuff riding on this. So who is going to win? This is Tornado Tag, by the way. They're in the they're in there at the same time. Oh wait, we got a we, wait, we got a prediction. Win channel points. Oh shit, we got it. Majima and Kira versus Sam and Max. Both desperately want to see their respective franchises continue. Get your channel points if you want to. Who do you think is going to win this match? Oh, what an entrance there. Flipping over the top rope. Just flying in. Taking his time with his bird feet. Has to be a dog. <laughs> 13, 14.8 to 11. Okay. And here comes Sam. I mean, Max. Who's the bunny? I really hope I'm not controlling a character because, like, I don't, I didn't set it up that way. All right, get your drinks going. Alcoholic or non-alcoholic, and here comes Max. And from New York, <laughs> weighing in at 130 pounds, Max. They all just live in a high-rise in New York, all of them.
It's like 60 apartments. It's the Germa house, but I'm not in New York. Right, I'm going to laugh so hard if I have to control a character because I'm going to be pissed because I'm going to have to restart it. <laughs> Did he have a shirt on? Well, wait, he's a bunny, so he doesn't have a shirt on. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here comes the beginning of this match. We're going to have Sam and Max versus Kiru. And I'm, how do I say that name? I'm saying it's so wrong. Ki how does it? Cure you. Okay, cure you. Cure you and Majima versus Sam and Max. Again, the winner of this competition gets another stream. Tornado tag matchup. They all have health on the bottom. And here we go. Oh, right off the bat. Sam with a flying leg kick. Right into Majima's face. They're also huge. <laughs> Look at the referee. Now, there are rules here. There are rules. <laughs> you, this, this is not a hardcore match. Snap suplex by Majima onto Sam. Right on his back. And taunting is Kiryu, which was a very, very bad idea. When it's Max <laughs> to kick him out of the ring. Kicks him completely out of the ring in one boot. Is he going to suplex him out of the ring? I'm not sure. No, he's going to throw him on the on the top rope. And knee him directly in his skull. Majima taking a little bit of punishment here. While Kiryu comes back in. And Max is absolutely destroying right now. I don't think Max has taken one punch. Sam has, though. Nice dodge by Max with the reversal into the triple shin kick. He's going for the pin. This, no way. It's way too early for that. <laughs> Wait, did he just hit his head? Now you would think that Hurricane Rana. That's a good reversal there from Kiryu. Max now in a little bit of trouble on the outside of the ropes here while Sam and Majima are still outside. And I think Sam has just thrown Majima back and forth three or four times. How come there's nobody here? Why isn't nobody in the audience? There's <laughs> nobody here. This event, like... <laughs> Max is carrying. I think I want to turn the... I want to turn the HUD off. I don't want to see the information. Looks like Kiryu set her for a powerbomb, maybe. No, he just let him go. He let him go. He keeps taunting. Now, what I was going to say earlier is you would think that Sam and Max would have the disadvantage here because they're not really fighters. They're more uh, investigators, detectives. Although, uh, Sam does have a gun. Nice suplex there by Sam out of Ajima. Uh, Kiryu working that skull cap of Max. Ajima looks like he's in a lot of trouble. Max is in a lot of trouble too, though. Setting it up here, looks like onto the top rope. No, well, he's trying to think about what he wants to do with him. He's going to throw him outside of the ring. Nope, just hit his face on that corner turnbuckle. Both of them want to see another stream so badly. Is Sam going to submit here? We might see a submit. No, reversal, punching a couple of times in the face, right in the nose, and then getting on top of him, doing a little twisty turny can run up. A lot of reversals. If you take a look at the health bars down there, you get to see Max is in a lot of trouble. Big DDT. Doing a lot of taunting. We see from Kiryu and Majima. This does not look good for Sam and Max right now. Big neck breaker, although Kiryu is bringing him over into the corner here. I'm not sure what his plan is. Max blew all of his energy in the first 30 seconds of the match. And he is almost toast. What? <laughs> Why did he fall down? Are they going to set up a double team move? <laughs> I heard a crunch! One, two! And that's it! That's it! Kiryu and Majima win the first match of the evening! <laughs> oh my god! He just broke every bone in his body. 
<laughs> oh, they gave him, when did he give him the stutter? <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations to Kiryu and Vajima. Yakuza Zero is going to get another stream. We will see another stream from Kiryu and Vajima. Sorry, Sam and Max. Max, Max I think, is dead. <laughs> oh. Oh, man. Did, I, I heard like a bunch of bones break. <laughs> he weighs so much. Kiryu is like a 200 plus pound man. And Max is a bunny rabbit. He weighs like fucking four pounds. That was horrible. Okay. Well, uh, we can move on to the next match in a minute here. We're going to do a couple more categories. That was the first match of the evening. I'm going to turn this off. We're going to keep this right here. And I just like, I blew snots out of my nose when he landed on him. I, I really did. I like blew my nose like hard. I don't want to, don't wipe it on the, I don't want to wipe it on the jacket. Hold on. What do I do? 38.7 million have been traded hands here. Congratulations to those that have bet. All right. Hold on a minute. I can't turn the camera on until I, I got to, oh, here we go. This is a napkin right here. I, I brought this up for a very specific reason. Use it as hair grease? Oh my god, you're disgusting. All right, let's get back to it. Hi. Thank you to the mods, by the way, that kind of jumped in there and fixed that up. Uh, are you guys ready? Oh, I have to do this real quick. Hold on. Uh, we're going to do the next category. Reddit shelf. That's right. I need to open the mixer. There we go. Okay. All right, coming up, the next category, the next two in a row, actually, uh, for the awards, are uh, singing. So, some of the best singing, some of the worst singing. We're going to start with the worst singing. What do you say? I lost all my money. You got villain hair tonight? Do I? I don't think it's villain hair right now. It has to be, like, slicked back. Dude, <laughs> that fucking crunch. I'm going to need a second. Uh, protagonist hair? Whatever. It's getting hot in this room, too. Uh, it's going to get... I'm going to have to take this jacket off in, like, ten minutes. All right, so we're singing here. The nominees for the worst singing. Sometimes I, I decide to go into some song. And sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. The worst part about these categories is pay attention. Because it really doesn't matter. What, which one is worst and which one is best? It could be, just flip them to any category you want. They're, it's all just kind of bad. So, here are the nominees for worst singing of the year. This is worst singing. Keep that in mind. That wasn't funny. 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 Oh, Bugs is now finished up. Just something on the wish list to keep us all going through the wind and the rain. There's no food on the table. There's men still in this rival. So we ain't going nowhere till we get some rain. That was bad. Speed of sound. The places to go, gonna follow my rainbow. Guys, there is a keep moving on. Fears right ahead. The way to. I don't know the lyrics. It was good. <laughs> it was so loud, I'm sorry. What? So. Who's broad stripes and. And the home of the Braves! Yodel, 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 yodel
Oh, at what point in this game do I go? What does that happen? Thank you for the raid. Really appreciate it. I am so happy. Thanks. Eight, 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 apples and bananas. I like to eat. Eight, eight, apples and bananas. There's a hair on the fly in the water, the frog. Ah! There's a. There's a hair. There's a hair on the fly in the. There's a hair on the fly on the water, the leg of the frog at the bottom of the sea. There's a hair on the fly on the water, the frog in the log. Fuck! Hey, I know you're new. Welcome to the stream. Pull up a chair. It's quite the dream. It's your first time here. Oh, what a joy! <laughs> But don't act like the stream is a toy. Oh, that was the worst one. I'm the bride. This open minds. This open minds. Like the 4th of July. Cause maybe you're a firework. Made of Joe and... Ow! Put the Kingdom Hearts music back on. Oh, there's one. And this morning I can't my voice is still fucked up I can't do it <clears throat> I, I I'll tell you I'm about I'm a little irritated with this one. A little irritated with this one. I don't know why this was so bad. I, I don't know why this one was considered to be so awful. Slightly irritated by this one. The winner of the worst singing of the year. Dame Dane with 18.5% of the vote. What was so wrong with that? Dame yo, dame, dame yo. Well, I, I, what, that's what, I, what was wrong? Uh, the raid song was in second place with 14.5% of the vote. And then the Yoshi Happy song was at 13.2% of the vote. There are your top three. The raid song was like four seconds long. I guess it means that's why it was the worst. Just like we do the worst. We're also going to do the best. Is there two connected here? Yoshi was good. Um, well, we're in the best now. We'll find out what really was the best. I'm just going to peek. I mean, I peeked. Why does it matter if I peeked? I wrote it down. <laughs> I'm the person who wrote the, I It's my handwriting. All right. Uh, coming up, we got best singing. Here we go. Here come the nominees for best singing of the year. Aren't you prepared? I'm talking quarter pound of beef on the hot, hot side. Stays hot. New McDLT. Crisp lettuce and tomato on the cool, cool side. Stays cool. New McDLT. The hot stays hot. The cool stays crisp. Put it together. You can't raise it. My ex and my bum, and my ex and my bum, and my bum. It's not even here. Uh, e -o. 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 Audio jungle. Uh, e -o. Uh, e -o. Audio jungle. Good. We're fine. I'm oh, safe. this is my favorite part. I love this part coming up here. Oh, that's my favorite part. I love it. Faster, slower, harder. Faster, slower, longer, higher. 
Hello, my love. I am here to have some fun with you and me. We'll see our destiny while we're in love. It's me, the comedy guy. Hey, look at that bitch. Excuse me, where are you going? Hey, don't hold up for me. It's me, the comedy horror guy. I just make fucking jokes. Well, I'm scared. It's me, the comedy guy. I'm ruining your fucking enjoyment of my playthrough. Shine the bright. <laughs> This open <laughs> minds, just open minds, like the 4th of July, cause maybe you're a firework, made of Joe and, ow! Mm, yummy, delicious banana, I can't wait to eat, okay, where do I find a car? <laughs> I just love delicious banana. What the fuck? Yeah. Uh, so yeah, of course, firework is on both best and worst singing, because you could, I guess, I hit some of those notes, but the end was really bad, and there, and I really sounded like kind of like an, a horn with no air left in it. Ah! So I mean, it, it could have been both, but you know, we'll see. We'll see what the people have voted for. The winner of best singing of the entire year goes to. You probably could guess it. It won by a shitload. Ooh. Uh, oh. oh my god. Uh, oh. oh my that's not even good. Uh, e oh. Uh, e oh. Uh, e oh. It won. Uh it won by it won fifty-three percent of the vote. More than half of you guys voted for that. Underneath that, at 15.4%. So you got to go really far down. Uh, was the McDLT song. And then at number three was Firework at 7.6% of the vote. 53% of you voted for it. Uh, what's next? we got a couple more to do, right? Uh, this is one of my favorite categories that has been added. This is... Uh, best one guy moment and best one guy moment has turned into one of my favorite things on this stream it's when somebody one of you is able to be to derail the entire stream and and almost sometimes change everything we're doing by a simple comment or something that you have said uh, so here are the nominees and I think there are a lot of them for the best one guy moment of the year Seriously, what does this have to do with anything? What does this have to do with anything? <laughs> what does this have to do with anything? <laughs> what does this have to do with anything? You put the dough in the pan and then put the pan in the oven. Yeah, I, I bet you, I bet your bread is real gross. We gotta do a public apology. <clears throat> so, a lot of you may have been aware of some of the things that I may have said on stream recently. Um, I really don't mean that, I didn't mean that at all, and yeah, I just kind of want to go back to um, kind of the way it was beforehand. And I'm very sorry. 
New offer. Read to us green eggs and ham without fucking up once. Remove 75 million. Oh, hello, everyone. Welcome to Fairy Tale Readings with me, Jeremy. Today we're going to be reading green eggs and ham. Oh, it's so wonderful. Would you eat them in a box? Would you eat them with a fox? Not in a box. Not with a fox. Not in a house. Not with a mouse. I would eat. <laughs> the music is like over each other. Is did somebody just make this account and start broadcasting and then screen cap it or fake it? Or is this the real account? That's real. Chuck E. Cheese is here. What are you? What's? What is Chuck E. Cheese doing here? What have you guys? What did you guys do? Why'd you do this? Yeah, he's. This it says hi, Germa in the thing, but I. It's because you gave him ten. You gave him ten dollars to do that. You literally won't get past the first part of fellowship. I guarantee it. All right, I, I want to. All right, I, I want to remember your name because when I get past level one in Fellowship of the Ring, I'm going to fucking scream your name. God damn it! I can't let this person be right. <laughs> I guarantee. I guarantee you're not gonna get to the first through the first part of Fellowship of the Ring for PlayStation Two. Guarantee. Fucking, I, they can't be right. They can't be right. They can't be right. <laughs> I saw, I just saw in the chat, the funniest thing I've seen all week. The funniest thing I've seen all week. Absolutely, without a doubt. In like the, in like the last five plus fucking streams. The funniest thing I've seen all week. You ready? They said, <laughs> Olive Garden music. That's perfect. It's fucking perfect. It's Marty's and Tootsie Rolls from like 1993. It's Marty's are great. Up your urethra. <laughs> Why did I read that? I, Jeremy Albertson, will not make any reference to The Binding of Isaac, World of Warcraft, Hearthstone, or Dark Souls during this stream. If I do, I will gift five community subs per reference. Fury vanquished. You see you. <laughs> Five subs. <laughs> no. There's one. There's a second stream right now. It's gone, and the title is "Hi Germa." You got 13.2 clicks per second. He's also cheating. Like you, you're, you're also cheating. Like you, you can go download an auto clicker and have it just click. Wait, you do 13.2. Ah, fucking lost. I gotta be 13.2. I can't let this guy be a better streamer than me. I can't. Dude, somebody said, why was he so out of breath? Is it, do you understand how much energy it takes to, to click that fast with your finger? To be able to do the rapid, like, 16 or, like, 20... It's between 16 to 25 clicks per second. Depending on the day. You use so much energy to go like this. It takes a lot. Okay, um... With 62% of the vote, 62.5%, it's just not even fair. It should have been in its own, like, category. It should have just been like, we should have just omitted it. It was, it's thick, German. Like, with 62.5% of the vote. It spawned a lot of shit. Right underneath that, you gotta, well, you gotta go pretty far. You gotta go down to, uh, with 11.8% of the vote, Chuck E. Cheese's appearance. Um, I mean, that was, that was pretty, that was pretty wild. Chuck E. Cheese's appearance had, I mean, he raided me, he like hosted me, and like somebody linked a picture of me kissing him. I mean, like that, it was, it was a wild stream. Uh, and then Smarties are great up your, um, somewhere, with 7.2% of the vote, but it wasn't even fair. It just, it seriously wasn't even fair. Lord of the Rings got robbed. <laughs> snubs, I also, snubs all over the place. Not photoshopped. <clears throat> I mean, it could have been. 
Uh, we're gonna do actually two more, because I feel like these need to be back to back before we do the next match. So, uh, <laughs> oh yeah. Coming up next are worst impression and best impression. Again, these categories I could go like this. And open it, and you wouldn't even know which one it was. So, uh, we're, we'll do worst impression first. Here comes the worst nominees for worst impressions of the year. I still can't get over that, like, four voice Andy in the beginning of this stream. There are 21,000 people here. What's up? At welcome. Hope you're having a good time. This is an award show. And it's a rumble. You're going to see that too soon. CBD. All right, here are the nominees for worst impression of the year. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. I don't understand why you're an idiot, and I'm gonna throw this thing on the floor, and it's gonna explode. And I don't know what you're talking about, Bill. No? I think you need to shut your mouth. The little guy has a mouth on him, I think. That's too bad. What's going on in here? I need to fly luck. Okay, all of them at once. So we got Marge. Marge. And then, uh... Lisa, Lisa, no. and then Bart, yeah, and then, and then, okay. Here we go. It's a me, you are you. I did not steal anything from Jim Gaffigan. He did. He stole so many things from Jim Gaffigan. I didn't steal anything. Oh, that's just... that's baloney! If anything, I have all my material completely not made. It's all mine. <sighs> he really thinks that, doesn't he? Diva is Elmo. Is Gollum. We want shit. We need shit. Diva, reporting for duty. It's also one of the Ed brothers. It could be anyone, Eddie. It could even be Elmo. The herd graders can speak? Did they talk like this? Have you ever heard a third grader talk? They talk like... Can I have some of that, please? I'll take... They don't all talk like that, what? They talk like this. I'll take one dose, please. I want one, too. Yeah, they do. What? You know, find somebody that can make a good cow noise. <laughs> you can't. It's really hard to do that. Everybody always does like a, oh, moo, moo. No. Dude, a cow actually goes like, I can't, nobody can do it. Um, two, eight, 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 <laughs> apples and bananas. Baby pop has oh, like been in almost every eight, category. Eight, eight, eight percent bananas. Hey, I, 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 hey, Rick. Hey, hey, Morty. Oh, what is it, Rick? I, 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 I turn myself into a green screen. Oh no! Yeah, Morty, Mo you, you can be whatever you want uh, uh, in front of in front of the green screen. No, uh, I don't want to be you, Rick. Yeah, to Morty, 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 get over there and be me. No, I don't want to, Morty. It's all you so. Who's in that room? Ah, uh, probably me in that chair. Oh, that was not good. <laughs> that was bad. That one. Hey, stop playing that. Why does it keep doing that? It wants to play one guy moment so bad over and over again. Uh, uh Baby Bop is in almost every bad category. Worst noise, worst singing. Was it in best singing too? Why is Baby Bop in every category? So I have to say something about this winner. This is just proof to me. That I need to stop doing and
any of the Simpsons ever again for the rest of my life. I'm never doing a Simpsons impression. Uh, all of the Simpsons at once won by, th it was 30, 31% of the vote. It's, it's going to be on here every single year. It's been on here every single year. If I do Homer, even for a second, even for one goddamn second, it's on here. If I do Lisa or Marge, it's on here every single year. Try Homer now. No, it'll be on here. No, th the best part about this stream is like a bunch of you guys forget the fucked up shit I'm going to do tonight. You know what I mean? And it's tech. Wait. And the here's the next best part about this stream. It ain't even January yet. So I, I, I could do whatever I want on these award streams. So it's the last day. You can't even nominate this. It's, it's lost forever. It's lost in a void. So, all right, here we go. Hey. Hey, Bart. It's me. Ooh, that's what I look like when I do that? Uh, in second place was Rick and Morty green screen with 11.4%. And, and then a cow at 10.7%. I could understand the cow one. And I can understand the Simpsons one. But the Rick and Morty green screen one I thought was like kind of good. I like thought I did a good job. Sometimes you think things that are not right. It's January here. What's, wait, what time is it right now? Nine. It's 9.30. Okay, it's 9.30 right now. I got. We're, we're dropping it on Eastern time. It's 6.30 my time, but it's 9.30 Eastern. We have two and a half hours. Okay. So uh, just like the bad ones, there are also the good ones too. This is best impression of the year. Actually, what? Yeah, okay. Okay. Otto? He's right there. Joe Otto. He's right there. He's, on a, he's sleeping. I'm not going to go wake him up just to get him on camera. Like, okay, what if somebody walked into your bedroom and fucking just opened the cupboard and was like, Hey, hey, come over here. What's going on? Come here, come here, come here. Hey, look, look, hey. Hey, what's up? Hey, look at the camera. What the fuck are you doing here? I don't want to do that. Like, he's sleeping. He's having, like, a nice rest. I don't want to, like, go disturb him. Just rotate the camera. Yeah, he's under the blanket though. You can't see him. All right, here come the cat the nominees for best impression of the year. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see if your favorite got selected. Let's see if your favorite got fucking selected. Press the right button, Jeremy. Don't press the one guy one again. Here we go. I don't want to do that, Mr. Turtle. I don't want to see that, and I don't want you to come into my house. Okay, game on. Do an okay acting challenge. R two D two dying. Easy. But there's a storm. Oh, it's not raining yet. Uh, besides, it's not actually that unsafe to swim in the storms. Everyone uh keeps telling me to get out of the sea. But it's safer in here than it is up there. Uh, <laughs> Bernie, how would you like to respond to that? I just thought I want to say that I think that answer was cringe. The following has encouragement. That's what it is. It's a bunch of compressed. The following has encouragement and love. We want to thank you for being here. You're the one that gets things done around here. Well, tell him a great job. Like, I think that we can maybe get some quality entertainment here, Scoob. <laughs> like, maybe we should stop streaming, Scoob. I think maybe that's a good idea. Yes. Yes. Maybe stop streaming! Maybe I'll screw that! Mitch McConnell. <laughs> now, now, let me, now, let me tell you about the, the, the stimulus. We are not ready to move forward on a stimulus. <laughs> not yet. 
Maybe soon we will move forward on that. But my uh, Madam Speaker, <laughs> Tell me everything you know. <laughs> like a parakeet. Yeah, it makes sense, right? Look at half of my mannerisms. Just like... Step on me! Step on me, bro! A steady diet of, like, Captain Crunch and bologna. That's how you end up like that. Uh, the winner of Best Impression of the Year is... <laughs> R2D2 dying sound with 34% of the vote. Second is Bernie Sanders with 18%. And then rounding us off at the end at number three was Mitch McConnell at 12.7. Mitch McConnell. <sighs> Coming up next, we have oh no 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 whoa 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 we're done we're done we're done we're done we're gonna do it we're gonna do a uh, a match political <laughs> how's that political. Mitch McConnell right now is like more hated than the Joker is in Gotham City in the fucking DC universe. But I, but I, really? <laughs> is that politics? It's still political. Yeah, whatever. It's the CBD coming out. It sure is. I promise I'm not pissing. You probably my my noise gate probably didn't even pick it up. Some, oh, by the way, somebody said CBD is unregulated. Okay, and bananas have radioactive poison in them. Whatever. Uh, we're gonna do the next match of the rumble. Let me make sure I get it. I gotta hold on. Let me turn this off for a sec. Let me just let me let me see if I can make sure that I we, I, don't, I don't want I don't want the HUD to be gone. I don't want a HUD. Yeah, uh, we're, 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 I, I know, I know. We're going to do the betting. This is going to be the second match of the evening, and this one is going to be very fun. It might even be funny, too. Let me just give the mods who it is. So they can do the prediction. Uh, I can remember the... <laughs> hold on. I can't remember the names. I don't remember the names. Uh... <laughs> Uh, wait, can you only do, wait, you can only do one. This is a three-way extreme rules match. I'm not sure we can, we can predict this one. Yeah, we cannot, we can't do the predictions on this one. You can only do uh, two. It's only two. Yeah, it's a three-way. It will, it will. Oh, when there are only two left, well, whoever whoever pins wins. And you know what? It doesn't even matter. I'll just I'll, I can show it to you right now, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Coming up next is the uh, the Ritz brothers comedy routine. Al Ritz, Jimmy Ritz, and Harry Ritz. Uh, extreme rules. Give you a little sneak peek. And uh, let me just make sure I can turn the HUD off. Where's the gorilla? Oh, should I turn the volume all down? Oops. That's right. I had to do that. Introducing first in the Ritz Brothers comedy match. They're going to do some uh, some slapstick for you. Is Harry Ritz. Way to the ring. 
I think he's the oldest. Weighing in at 200 pounds. <laughs> also from Harry New York. Ritchie. Harry Ritchie? What? All right, let me see if I can do this. Can I, can I turn off the HUD? What? Go get him. <laughs> There's Harry Ritz pointing to the ceiling thinking he's gay. Uh, I don't, I think all these guys. Why does it say that in the bottom right corner? I, just, I think I just put it there. Yeah, these guys are from the, the public domain movie night earlier this year. Was that even, might have even been 2019. I don't, hey, by the way, they don't have to be from this year. We have like two years of characters to catch up with. Uh, when you see one Ritz Brothers entrance, do you really need to see the other two Ritz Brothers entrances? That's what I want to ask you guys. <laughs> I guess the answer is yes. I didn't get all... opponents first from New York. Weighing in at 200, oh, 200 pounds. pounds. Alan Ritchie. <laughs> all from New York. All 200 pounds. Which is like a, a... Oh my god, I can't even... <laughs> is he showing his armpits? Hey, what do you think of these ones, boys? Uh, did they, somebody asked, did they remove custom arenas? No, I tried to make one, but 2K20 is such a piece of steaming, burning shit that the game would crash when I changed the colors of the ropes. Yeah, it just, you just can't do it, apparently. I, I, I can't make it through the ropes. Explosion's coming out here. This, who is this? Oh, of course, it's it, it's it's the youngest brother. That's Jimmy Ritz. And from New York, weighing in at 200 pounds, Jimmy Ritchie. <laughs> the, the, their intros are so long. <laughs> That's it. So what are they? Gonna, this is an Extreme Rules match. There's no stakes here, by the way. They just wanted to come to. Trim a Rumble 2020 and show us their comedy routine. The Ritz Brothers are like the Three Stooges, but um, sort of like the off brand serial version of the Three Stooges. And I'm going to make a statement here. I think the Ritz Brothers are funnier than the Three Stooges. I think they have more comedy. I think they have much more uh, style. Because, I mean, the Three Stooges simply just hit each other in the head with their fists and, like, poke their eyes with their fingers and stuff. The Ritz brothers go on detective searches. They cook food. But hold on one second here. Can I pause it? I can't even pause it. Hot stays. And, oh, but a beautiful, beautiful slap to the chest. I don't know who is who. So, this is the Extreme Rules comedy routine. I think that was Jimmy Ritz. I think that was Hal Al. I don't even know who they are. And Jimmy Ritz with a DDT onto Al Ritz's skull. Going for a pin automatically. He's not going to get it down. As Bob Ritz sticks in here. Going for probably a pilot driver or something. Power bomb or what a reversal by Jim Ritz. Is he going to let it happen? No way. You can't just let that happen like that. And Al Ritz gets grabbed by German suplex onto Al Ritz. Full punch in the face from Harry Ritz. Another one. No reversal by Jimmy Ritz. <laughs> this is so funny. I love it they like bop each other in the head and stuff. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> These guys are so goddamn funny. 
What's he gonna do? Ooh, a little slap in the face. As Jimmy Ritz is outside the ring, currently grabbing off for dear life, as one of the, I don't know, one of the other ones. Jimmy Ritz is going into this corner here. It looks like he might have been looking for something. Jimmy Ritz is going underneath to get a comedy utensil. And he's got a chair. The funniest object there is. And he doesn't even get to use it. He just gets punched in the face by Harry Ritz. And a belly-to-belly -belly suplex for his trouble. Only one comedy utensil in the ring right now. Jimmy Ritz. Oh, no. All of them go outside. <laughs> has a sludge hammer. Oh, and he misses completely. They don't really want to hurt each other. This is actors. <laughs> and Jimmy Ritz takes an eye poke, a classic comedy eye poke. I think Hal Ritz is, I think Harry Ritz is bleeding. <laughs> what is that, out of pool cue? <laughs> Do not let him pin him. There are now three comedy utensils. You see, he was like, ah, I'm gonna get you. Watch out, wise guy. Dropping him right on the tailbone. That's gotta hurt. Into the ropes here, misses the punch. Great comedy duck. Oh, they, they do that so well. They're so good at this. By the way, everybody needs to know this. They're not actually hurting each other. They're doing just enough damage and just enough pretending to make it look good on camera. Although that one looked real. So did that one. That one, this looks pretty real, Harry. Uh, Harry, Harry, you, you've been going a little too hard. Cameras aren't even rolling anymore. And I think, is that gonna be it? No way! Oh my goodness. Jimmy Ritz going to get another comedy utensil down here. What do you got? He's got a baseball bat. Actually injured right now. As Jimmy Ritz breaks it up. <sighs> You're just masterful comedian. Gonna bring him up to the corner here, up to the top turnbuckle. What is Jimmy Ritz planning to do to his brother Harry Ritz? He's got him all the way up here. He's gonna go for a suplex. <laughs> a suplex off the top rope. Oh, and there's no way Harry's gonna get up from that one. <laughs> so many reversals by Jimmy Ritz. We're gonna go for a forward. Wow, beautiful flipping backwards neck breaker there. Fantastic stuff. Jimmy Ritz going for the pin. Can Al get in there quick enough too? He completely missed. Not the bat again. Not the comedy bat. DDT by Jimmy Ritz onto Al. Al is in bad shape. He's in really bad shape right now. As now Jimmy, uh, Harry seems to have the most HP out of the three of them. Big dropping suplex there. Gonna try to go for a pin. No, bring him to the center of the ring. Lying next to his brother. This is a little weird. Ooh, face stomp right in the, right in the forward part of your face. Nice reversal by Jimmy Ritz. That hurt his hand. He actually hit him. We might have to cut here. He actually punched him in the face accidentally. Put down the sledgehammer. No, he... D this looks like a finishing move. No, it's just a throw. Just a throw, and now he's taunting. That's Harry Ritz, by the way. The strongest of the three brothers. Taking it outside. Now he gets thrown right back in. This is Al, I believe, and uh, Harry is now stuck in the ropes. 
That may have just been a broken neck. There's no way that this is going to work out this way. Jimmy Rich is still outside. We've got a one count. We've got a two count hit. No. And just like every Three Stooges movie and every Ritz Brothers movie, this is going on for way too long. There's only so many times you can poke somebody in the eye for 97 straight minutes. And Jimmy Ritz comes in with a victory. Finishing the comedy routine for the German Rumble 2020. I love how we're watching the replay of a, a pin that didn't work. Not even a mention of the bat that was involved earlier. <laughs> They're all dead. What? Please remember predictions. Uh, well, we couldn't do predictions for this one because you can only do two, um, like one versus one. So with a three-way, it would be hard to do. We'll do it for the next one, though. I promise. Um, you know what the funniest part is? I I thought that that was gonna be like the lamest match of the evening, but that turned out to somehow be like the best one so far. Match two is now over. We will now move on. Why do they look like... Why does it look like Herman Munster? I don't know. <laughs> Dude, the bat... When they just kept trading the bat back and forth and hitting each other in the face. Oh. God. <clears throat> that was funny. All right, moving on. We got some more categories to do, obviously. Uh, we actually... You know what? We'll take a break after this next run of categories. How does that sound? Let's turn that volume mixer down and we come back to this. Uh, the next one. We'll take a break after this, yeah. Hi. Welcome back to the awards uh, section of this stream. Like maybe should I get some light on me? I got jump scared? Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, best joke taking more than five minutes to set up. And you're probably wondering what happened to worst joke taking more than five minutes to set up. Well, there really wasn't very many or they were so bad that they could not even be nominated. So we only have a best of this year for 2020. It just like burped so loud inside of my body. If there was a microphone inside of my esophagus down here, you guys would have freaked out. It was really loud in here. I could hear that internally. What is up? <clears throat> Gas. Uh, e oh. Well, I didn't, no, no, I didn't even do the nominations yet. Uh-oh. CBD's kicking in. Uh, all right, so best joke taking more than five minutes set up. What this means is uh, I kind of I just take a few minutes to do something, and I set it up, and I try to make uh, people laugh. And let's say four to ten times it works out. The other six, I get ridiculed off the stream. But here we go. Now here are the nominees for best joke taking more than five minutes to set up. What's in the cup? It's just a little, it's just a little CBD THC sippy, you know? Nothing major, just something to have fun and relax. All right, here come the nominees for uh, best joke taking for the five smin. Okay, it's, it's hit me. Uh oh, there was an estimate that there was going to be a, a SPI stimulus package, and it didn't happen. Oh shit, all the investors were expecting it. It didn't happen. CEO tweeted out picture of asshole with two middle fingers on it and said, fuck all investors. Oh, that, holy shit, that's the only way this would have happened. Come on. Hello? Hey, what's up? It's me. Oh, hey, what's going on? How are you doing? I'm doing good. Did you get my messages that I sent you? Yes, I did. You know what to do! You know what to do, man of the hour! Say it! Say the line, you came just in time. It's time to solve it. Oh! Oh, are you alright? You okay? My leg! That, that was my leg. 
This next room is terrible, disgusting, dastardly. You have one minute. In this room, you do the fold of ten t-shirts the way they do that old navy. Will you stand the smelly smells for ten minutes? Or will you puke into the toilet? Audio jungle. Audio jungle. Good. We're fine. Oh, this is my favorite part. I love this part coming up here. Oh, that's my favorite part. I love it. Professor Michaels took a fraternity test to find out if they were the father of Mrs. Stevenson's baby. Join us today for a new episode of the morning announcements. And by the way, hey, Mr. Mr. Whatever your fucking name is, I can't believe you. You want to tell me it's my baby? It is your baby! No, it's not. I, yeah. Why did you... What just... You threw something at me. Ow! My face! Another CCTV. Holy... Holy shit, Jerry! It what started as a small confrontation has turned into an absolute bloodbath brawl outside of the 7-Eleven. It looks like they're, they're upset that McDonald's is, they're, they're upset that Roger, I'm not even entirely sure where they got these weapons. The battle, the battle, the battle for Home Depot. Roger, people, uh, people on social media are calling this the battle of Home Depot. I'll be bunny. There you go. Mom, I'm really my, my mother's probably watching the stream going, what the fuck is this kid doing? I didn't raise him like this. Hey, um. Yeah, I'm alright. I just had some work done. This is what a toddler does when they know they did something wrong. That should be an emote. <laughs> Stanley Kubrick. <laughs> Kubrick stare. <laughs> Yeah, I'll take. I'll, well, can I take a bite and will you guys get over this? If I take a bite of this, will you get over it? Fucking <laughs> 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 sands. He should never have been in the game. He's not even a Nintendo character. All right, let's go. Right behind you. Right behind him. Right behind him. Shit, I fell down. I'll be up in a minute. Okay, we'll be up here. Need heals here. Need heals. I'm out of mana. Need heals. Make a potion or something, dude. What the fuck? Hey, where are you? you guys know where I am? I don't know where I am. I'm in the water. Need help to me, to me, to me, to me. I got two! I got two! Fucking idiots, I have two! We're coming, we're on our way! And I, I'm gonna die like- I'm gonna die here. And that's fine. I'll fucking take it up with the guild leader later. This is like- this is the type, type of shit- this is why we can't get to fucking top 100. <clears throat> well. Uh, so. This one is the- I believe the closest one of the- of the entire evening. Uh, this one was by a margin of like seven tenths of a percentage. So the two top ones are both 20% and then something. Just to let you know, this is the closest one of the auto. Yes, auto has awakened. Uh, I. <laughs> Having fun? You having fun over there? He's just like rubbing his back like a bear on a tree. And he's just sneezing. What are you doing over there? Otto, who do you think's gonna win? 
Who do you think is gonna, what do you think is gonna win best joke taking more than five minutes to set up? Cookies. Uh, well, that's not, that's not on the, that's not a category, Otto. That's not a nominee. The winner of best uh, joke of the year, taking more than five, was just pretty much best joke of the year. Let's just go for it. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner. With 20.86% of the vote. The Jigsaw House. With 20.08% of the vote. Eating the shoe. Lost very close, very close. Uh, in third place was A-E-U, which I know that it's supposed to be five minutes, but I think that bit went on for like 30. So, it was allowed. Just chilling? Uh, yeah, Jigsaw House 20, uh, well, 15.7% for A-E-U, by the way. Recency bias, recency bias. Probably, but, you know, it's still fun. All right, coming up, we have, uh, let's take a look. I got another match to do, but I want to take a break first. So we have, how many was that? The best jokes. So we had one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. All right, so we have, uh, we'll do two more. Cookies was robbed. Yeah, well, whatever. Uh, this is the two of the night that I think are going to be the most irritating to sit through. For a lot of you guys, so I just want to give you a warning now. Some of you guys that might be new here, you might leave the stream in about two minutes. Uh, the next categories are going to be worst noise of the year and best noise of the year. And there were a shitload of nominees. The, I, there's like 20 nominees in worst noise. So, strap yourself in and get ready to hear some of the things you don't ever want to hear ever again. There sure were. Yes, there were. Uh, so here are the nominees, ladies and gentlemen, for Worst Noise of the Year. <laughs> you didn't even see me. I didn't even... Whatever. Is it there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Somebody just squeezed a little too much air out of me. All right, this is cool. I'm I'm gonna sneeze, but I I cannot mute my microphone. Uh, 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 <laughs> funny man, make a funny noise. Funny man, make a funny noise. All right, fine. I don't think I could hit a bong, man. I really don't think I could in real life. I would probably fucking fall down. I would hit the bong, it'd be like... <laughs> also nominated for worst face. Keep your mouth. <laughs> what are these, um... What are these, like, little, like, white things on the ground do? Are these, like, collectibles? <laughs> oh! What? I didn't fucking see here. that guy. Give us a joke. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that one on here? <laughs> Did I do it? Cover it with cheese. The ooey gooey cheesy. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Does it have like a bunch of fucking nacho cheese on it? Oh, beast. I know. I get it. But it's still good. Oh, how can we make a. How can we make like a Caesar salad better? Hmm. Cover it with ooey gooey yummy cheesy cheesy cheesy. 
Derma is just a scary motherfucker. No, but I, am I though? I completely disagree. <laughs> I disagree. Lick Whale Lord. Oh, dude, now wouldn't that be so gross? <laughs> oh, I'm good. Oh, come on. Fuck. Donkey sound? No, oh, excuse me. That was not a donkey sound. This is a donkey sound. <laughs> oh, that's one of those ducks at the store that you squeeze the dog toy. Never mind. I tried. <laughs> so many nominees. <clears throat> so many nominees for this category. But there can only be one winner. Uh, there can only be three that are even listed. So the winner of... The best noise of the year. No, 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 shit, that's wrong. It's worst noise of the year. The winner of worst noise of the year is going to be... With 11.66% of the vote, we have Ooey Gooey. Ooey Gooey won with 11.66%. Um, I think, I, you know, it's not even a noise. I, I just talked. I just said a sentence. Um, I think it's just everybody hated the sentence, therefore nominated it so often and everybody voted for it. Um, so after that, uh, very, very close though, with 11.16% of the vote, so another very, very close one, even closer than the last one, was the horrendous pig. <clears throat> so if you want to be a purist here, you could say that the horrendous pig was the worst noise of the year. And ooey gooey was the most hated phrase of the year. After that, at 9.05% is Chewbacca transforming. I could see that. I could see that. Yeah, I could see that. Acceptable. Yeah, it's, it's an acceptable win. There are your winners. Oh, uh, what's the next one? Right here. Uh, so just like worst noise, we have best noise. Now, best noise... Um, does it, no, it doesn't include anything like singing or anything. Uh, this is just what people thought was a better sound, or thought it was cooler, thought it was funnier. The only thing I can't believe about this one is there's a, there's a nominee on here that is so ear-screechingly horrible that I cannot comprehend why it is not in the other category. So just be aware, there is like ear scraping there's like ear like a like a, a q-tip going in there and just like <sighs> it's i'm just warning you now here we go nominees for best noise of the year just wanted to warn you where's best noise <laughs> Best noise of the year. You're never going to get a pan fully clean like this. What's over there? A local and stop! No whammies! Nobody tell them. 
tell me what. Don't hold that shit for me. Take a look at this scrumptious cheese pizza. I swallow. I like cartoon python swallowed a plate or something. My character right now is going like, <laughs> and I want you to listen to that crunch. You were wrong. You were wrong. Winner of the best noise of the year, I think, won this like a year or two ago. I can't do this anymore either, because when I do this, people just vote for it. People just nominate it, and people just go, yeah, that's the one. Uh, the winner is... Well, I gotta play the fanfare. Didgeridoo at 20.36% of the vote. So more than 20% of the vote. Didgeridoo won, uh, and then Doi Doi, which got 14.5% of the vote, which confuses me, because the first time I ever did the Doi Doi thing, uh, people screamed at me, they said, stop, that hurts my ears, I hate it, never do that again, don't ever do the Doi 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 thing ever again. And then two years later, I do the Doi 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 thing again, and all of a sudden now it's just second place for best noise of the year. What happened? Your tastes change? I'm gonna do it right now. There you go. Oh, and my ears won uh, with 11.5% in third place. I'm leaving. Don't leave, please! 11.5% uh, for my ears, which is the one that would hurt. That's the one that hurt. I think, um, does that catch us up? We're in front of the match? After we take a break? Let's see. How, how caught up are we? Was that, was that four? I believe that was four. We had one, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Yes, we did. Okay. All right, let's take a quick break. I'll be right back. I'm going to just get another, maybe another drink. Maybe. Uh, see if Otto needs to get anything. See if Otto needs to go out, and I'll be right back. See you guys in a minute.
Hello. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. I have returned to set up the next match in the Rumble. So the next match is going to be a four-way uh, tables, I believe, tables, ladders, and chairs match. Don't be sus. Oh, God. There always has to be a tables, ladders, and chairs match. You hear the crowd? Uh, let me make sure the next one is set up. Yeah, here it comes. Uh, hold on a sec. Let me get that over here. Okay. Where is this? I need to move this. Ow. This light is... Oh, shit. Okay, I don't want to break anything. All right, so again, this is a TLC match. God. <laughs> TLC, and it is between a lot of different fandoms. A lot of different fandoms here. If you could think of a, a certain group of people that love a certain franchise or certain characters, you'd put them into a, uh, into a crew, wouldn't you? And we've had quite a few crews over the years, especially considering the last couple of years. The next match is going to be a four-way between those crews. So let me, uh, let's go. Welcome back to the rumble portion of the stream. First character being introduced is, is Murius of the Moo Crew. Also was nominated for Best New Character York, of the Year. Weighing in at 220 pounds. Ooh, 220. Godfather. <laughs> That's not the name of that animal is not Mega Milk. It is Murius. Representing the Moo Crew. Ladder back there. Whoa! Somebody in the audience. Uh, he uh, he must have he must have that gray leash attached to him. I know how he gets when that's on him. The anger leash. Our next competitor coming in here to challenge the Moo Crew and the other two are the Wink Dinks. Jeremy Wink. And his opponents, first from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds, the <laughs> Superstar. Superstar, okay. So, yeah, 75,000 channel points. A lot of you got really into that. So, obviously, Jerma Wink wanted to come and represent himself to represent the Wink Dinks. Can you guess where this guy's from? Coming up next. I wonder. <laughs> I got you know what? I'm gonna put my money on the Dinks tonight. I think they have a lot riding here. They've been waiting for Winks to come back for like a year and a half, and they're just not coming back. Most dedicated fan base, I think, is. But wait a minute! I'm talking about dedicated fan bases. We're having a de talking about dedicated fan bases. I think that's Nancy Drew. That's Nancy Drew. Representing the Drew Crew. Nancy Drew, with her ATV looking to find a new part of, a, 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 a new clue for an old Egyptian temple. Stumbled her way in here, she, she knew that she needed to be represented. But that's not all. There's still one more group, one more incredibly Incredibly important group in this channel, in this universe here. You know, I talk about it all the time. I say it all the time. I address you guys as such.
Still on Nancy Drew, though. <laughs> it's the Banana Brothers! Oh, and nobody seems to like the Banana Bros. And from New York, weighing in at 200 pounds. <laughs> is, everybody hates the Banana Bros. I, why are they booing the Banana Bros? <laughs> Somebody wrote, oh my God, fuck this guy. All right, can I skip this? Can I skip this ship? Everybody hates him. <laughs> I love this guy. I love the Banana Bros. <laughs> Murius, the Wink Dinks. Moo Crew, Wink Dinks, Drew Crew. Versus the Banana Bros. Fatal Four Way Tables, Ladders, and Chairs match. Nancy Drew is not wasting a single second of her time. Throwing Murius into the ropes. Over the ropes now. There are I don't there are no rules here. Zero rules. It's just whoever loses. Where wait, where are all the items? Where are all the items? It's supposed to be tables, ladders, and chairs. I don't see a single table. I don't see a single ladder. I don't see a single chair. You forgot to put them out? What? Are you serious? <laughs> oh, the banana. The banana is getting absolutely bruised right now. Am I blind? What do you mean? It's under the ring? Where are they going? No, no, oh, I see up top, up top, up top, up top. Holy shit, that was a big right hand overhead smash from Murius onto Nancy Drew. By the way, whoever wins this, this is what I will call this channel's community for the next six months. So, uh, there's a lot riding on this one. Big punching match here in the middle of the ring. Yuri seems to have missed that double twisted kick of boozled. What? I, I, I kick a palizzle? <laughs> Somebody get a table in here! Oh, finally, the, the Banana Bros always taking the initiative. Reaching under the ring, getting the first ladder of the evening. They are the, one of the most dedicated, one of the most passionate fandoms on this channel, the Banana Bros. Looks like he's gonna... No, he's not gonna be able to have any time. The ladder... Was stolen by the Wink Dinks. Wink Dink just wants to get up there. I don't think he was supposed to. No. They're just setting it up. Ready to go. Nancy, Drew, and Murius have been outside this whole time. Just punching each other in the face. Oh, I, and she heard me. That was a huge kick from Nancy, Drew. Leave, ooh, DDT onto the ladder. Might see another. Uh, might see a ladder set up here. <laughs> of all the things you could have done, Banana Bro, that was probably the worst one to do. Mirius setting up the ladder, though. Mirius thinking about getting... No. Mirius is getting something else. Mirius is going to get one of the chairs over here. He went a long way to get that single chair. I hope it was worth it. Just like in black and white, the AI is so bad with their pathing, but he gets the hit. He gets two hits. And Nancy <laughs> Drew was just concerned about what was currently happening and Murius cleaning up right now. The Moo Crew. Big elbow drop. Nancy Drew was just trying to stop. She was looking at her dialogue options. One of them was, please don't hit him. The other one was, how much did that cost? And the other one was, where can I find the bar? Murius is getting up to the top. No, Nancy Drew throws him down. Kicking him right into his sternum. Both going outside again. There's an opportunity here for Banana Bros. Doesn't look like they're going to capitalize, though. Nancy Drew with a swinging neckbreaker. 
But Winkting from behind, Nancy Drew. <laughs> oh, shit. And the wink dink, he's, he's, he's signaling his crowd to do everybody to wink in the crowd. But <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> he wanted attention. They're all just craving your attention. They're all just trying to get attention. They so badly want you to look at them. Moo crew, moo crew. Banana bros, oh, this way, banana bros. Banana bros out. Ladder set up again. Murius going in for a swinging DDT tornado style. Mukru signaling his fans now to spam the chat room. Big right hand onto Nancy Drew. Swinging her around. Dropping down. And this opportunity is being taken by the Wink Dinks. Wink Dinks are going up, but Murius... He's almost going to get it. Is he going to get it? Murius going for the punch of the stomach as the Wink Dinks going to win. Can the Wink Dinks possibly secure this? Three punches, four punches in the stomach, and here comes the Banana Bro. <laughs> no, he's trying to push it down. Why is nobody trying to grab? He can't even push it down. He's not strong enough. <laughs> Why did he take it? Why did he take it? <laughs> They're just running into each other. Big belly to back suplex by Mirius. Signaling the Mukro. He's ready. He's ready to have you guys be called that for the next six months. Nancy Drew has finally gotten up. Finally. Getting back into the ring. It seems like ages ago that she was in this, and she's going to take the opportunity to go up. Nancy Drew with the Drew crew going up to the top rope. Going on top. She's got the briefcase. Is Nancy Drew going to pull this off in the. In the. <laughs> In the, the the absolute calamity going on, Nancy Drew might have actually just gotten this. She can't do the mini game. Oh, she was always so bad at this one. <laughs> Grabbing his arm. Wink Dinks is throwing down Murius. Caught in the ropes. Wink Dink is very strong right now. Murius has the most health. But uh-oh. Now, wait, no, 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 no. You got to get back in there, Banana Bro. You can't just, just, you got to get in there. You got to push that thing over right now. You almost got it. Push it over, push it over. I don't want to call everybody wink dinks for the next six months. Don't push it over. Somebody get up there, please. Furious, please. Somebody stop it. Nancy Drew, run your ATV into here and run it over. How has he still got this? Banana Bro is just like, yeah, I don't understand. This is fucked up. Big power bomb off. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Why is she on the top rope? Wait, why is she sitting on the top rope? Banana Bro got the ladder setting it up. Is this the Banana Bro's victory lap right now? Looks at Nancy Drew. Does not, does not attack her. She's on the top ropes. Is she going to go for it? No! That was the worst thing you could have done. Nancy Drew, go! Oh! Catches him. Oh, the skill, the the app, the just the necessity of that moment. She investigated. She took a look at her clues. And she found out that that was probably the best idea, and maybe it's going to be a good enough idea to win this match and be called the Drew Crew for the next six months. Nancy Drew, ladies and gentlemen, has unlatched it. The Drew Crew prevails once again, as they always do. Drew Crew has prevailed. Nancy Drew with the win. Nancy Drew. Well, congratulations to Nancy Drew. Drew Crew. That's what you guys are going to be called now. You're the Drew Crew now for at least six months. That was a huge clutch. The big jumping, two handed, two foot stomp. Kicking off the top rope. That's a deserved win for Nancy Drew. Banana Bros, you had a chance, but you really blew it. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going. <clears throat> that was match number three. There is another match before the Rumble. We got some more categories to do, though.
turn that down. And I will be joining you back here in a sec. Like this. Hello. So coming up on the next uh, nominee, the next nominees. Uh, a very, very, uh, I like this category a lot. I feel like this happens all the time, so there's a lot to choose from. It is a best scare moment. Best time that I was ever scared on stream. Whether a jump scare or, uh, or likewise. Is he high? Probably a little. Probably a little. It's New Year's Eve. Whatever. What, are you, uh, what do you want? Just maybe just a little. Maybe just a tiny, it's a little bit. It's a small amount. He's fucking zonked. <laughs> no, I'm not. The Wink Dinks did all the work. Yeah, the Wink Dinks did all the work, and then Nancy Drew uh, just kind of... Nancy Drew and the Banner Bros really just capitalized, so... Hey, what can I tell you? I don't make the rules. We just watch. Uh, so here are the nominees for Best Scare of the Year. I played VR this year, so you know there's going to be at least like 10 of those. So here they are. Best Scare of the Year. You do make the rules. No, I don't. What the fuck? Oh my god! I thought that was in real life. That scared the shit out of me. I was like, who's here? Why are you here? What the fuck? Okay, that was fucking... I, that, that, was the, that was one of the scariest things I've ever seen in my life. That's one of the scariest things I've ever seen in my whole life. I didn't, that was horrible. That was horrible. That was terrifying. That was the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. My whole life. <gasps> there are more copies of Wii Sports out in the wild than there are ants. I know. But why, why I didn't want one? <laughs> that was the warning? What, what do you mean I just got warned for me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude! Alex. I'm getting fuck out of here. That sound. Right. Oh, God. Oh, ow, my chest. My whole body hurts. My whole body hurts. Oh my God, what the? Oh my God, dude. Okay, so you've seen the nominees. Uh, the winner of best scare moment of the year. Let me see what one first. Pretty good. Uh, what do you think? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what the, what the what the people think here now. Cheater. You don't. You can't cheat at an award show. Oh, you probably. Yeah, you actually, you can. Yeah, you can. You probably can. Award shows. The deer. The deer. The deer. I'm seeing a lot of deer. Hate to disappoint all the people that are saying, Dear, the winner of Best Scare Moment of the Year is... Peeking down the hallway at 17% of the vote. In Five Nights at Freddy's, I was lied to. Uh, I was told that that's not supposed to happen. I was told that that was just of like a 0.2% chance. And I was told to do it again. And it happened again. And then I realized I was very angry with you. Uh, so, yeah, then you got me. Twice. Uh, that was 17%. They were all still pretty close. No air left was 12.82%. 
which I'll be honest with you, that was probably that was probably the for me at least. If I if I if this was no voting allowed here, uh, that would be the worst one for me. I remember that very vividly. It was fucking horrible. And then Bunny in the Room at 12.5%. That one got pretty high because, I, I mean, I was, like, drinking. Right? I had been drinking, and it was just so easy just to scare the shit out of me. So, I, that I could understand. I was pretty jumpy. So, yeah, that's uh, peeking down the hallway. Wins the best scare moment. Drunk. Yeah, I was, I was, yeah, I was. He took the headset off. He was so scared. Okay, let's, uh, what do we got? We have, I'm gonna make sure there's enough left to do at the end, too. Oh, yeah, there is. Let me get the, all right, let's get this one out of the way now. Because, uh, I want the top categories to be the last thing that we do. Before the rumble. Or after the rumble. Okay, so the next one, this is best accident. I, I, t I tend to have lots of accidents on stream. Uh, whether that's falling down somewhere, uh, IRL, whether that's messing up something, uh, saying something I shouldn't say. This is a new category. Uh, I make mistakes all the time. I'm only human. I make mistakes and, and I have to live with them, okay? So here are the nominees for the best accidents of the year. I'm going out. This is not the way I'm going out on Twitch. All right. Long story short, I can bring the switch into the bathroom and I can sh shit on it and keep and keep my hands close and not have to worry about my legs tingling. So I can get up whenever I want and put it over. Okay. My nieces and nephews love Lego Star Wars. It's like their favorite thing in the world. And I got a text from my parents and from my sister that said. Hey, um, just want to let you know, the kids were watching your stream because they love Lego Star Wars, and we had to mute you because you kept saying fuck so much. Show us the console. Oh. All right, hold on. Let me show you the console. I don't, whatever. Am I wearing beads on my wrists? Shit. Shit that you saw it. God damn it! It's it's black tourmaline. It's like a crystal bracelet. I I I'm just wearing it because um I, I, it's a crystal bracelet. It's black black tourmaline, and it's uh, supposed to help with your energy. It's not. It's made up. Like it's literally all made up. Uh, this is kind of how uh, this is kind of how I feel. It's like forty percent of every day. Can I tell you that? Not like that. 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 So. What can I do for you? <laughs> uh, tell me about. The tell me about Paseo del Mar High. So it's, it's, it's already school. people are already. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh my God! No, oh, this is gonna be. Like... <laughs> One of the students was murdered in the school last week. We're all pretending to be students. No, no, stop, 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 stop! I'm gonna make it more expensive. I'm gonna make it more expensive. All right, I'm gonna turn it off. I'm gonna turn it off. I'm gonna make it more expensive. I, 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 I remember I'm mid piss. I'm peeing. It's mid piss. It's like a 20 to 30 second full piss. This didn't even happen on stream. 10 seconds into the full piss. I drop it right, right it, and I'm pissing on the phone. I'm pissing on the phone and it's in piss water into the toilet. Peeing on it. There we are. <laughs> oh, shit. What happened? Okay, so, so what, what has happened is I pressed the back button, and this is when I uh, when I searched for AI Dungeon an hour and a half ago to play it, and I spelt it uh just a little a little incorrect. What? What's this doing on here? What's this doing on here? 
Oh shit! Okay, how, where's this picture? What's wrong with this one? It wasn't on fucking purpose, I swear to god. I swear to god, I swear to god. Why are you doing this? No, no, I just... I, I, I just I, I just own the Raving Rabbit's fucking ultimate party collection, which is every single video game they made. <laughs> oh, come on! Hey, German on eight five here. <laughs> Holy shit! This is something I can't show on stream. <laughs> <laughs> so as you see, uh, new category, new uh, new thing to th feed through, right? Feed through. <laughs> oh, he's getting zonked on stream. Uh, so the winner of the uh, best accident. <laughs> he's fucking zooted. <laughs> the best accident was you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you motherfucker. Uh, okay, anyways, the winner... Of the winner of <laughs> best accident is got him. Oh, you didn't, you didn't hear it. Come on. At 18.5% of the vote, Chucky e. Cheese. Mm. I just keep thinking about what that guy said over and over again. Uh, kissing Chuck E. Cheese was at 18.5% of the vote. Uh, that was very bad. Very bad accident. Uh, if you were not here for that stream, like I said, Chuck E. earlier, Chuck E. Cheese raided the stream and was here and we were being fucking weird. And then somebody linked a picture of me kissing him and I showed it on stream accidentally. And he was here and he was hosting the channel. So that's a pretty big accident. Uh, that was 18.5%. And then Naked was 169 so that was, it's still close. So just under 17% for naked. And uh, streaming and driving was 12.6%, number three. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure I agree with number three. I think I might put something else there. But uh, Lego Star Wars was robbed. <laughs> uh, yeah, ch kissing Chuck E. Cheese is the winner. Which, I mean, that was a pretty horrible fucking accident, so. Uh, what do we have left that's not the final four? Okay. Here we are. So, this next one coming up is Worst Meltdown, which, Worst Meltdown is different than a lot, it's, it's hard to do Worst Meltdown because so many of the nominees could be entire streams. So, it's not necessarily just one moment or two moments or... It could be the whole entire broadcast. So we kind of let it things pass where it could be just a full stream. So keep that in mind when you're watching these nominees. 13 straight hours of it, potentially. Yeah. Uh, here are the nominees for worst meltdown of the year, either moment or stream in particular. having a little cranky wanky right now. Ooh, boo -hoo. 
Oh, this is too hard. Oh, it's stretchy. I don't like it. How is how to beat this? I need to get Bubba. I need to go to bed and have a Bubba. I did it. 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 But we're at we're on the last fucking disc. I'm so close to ripping it out and just frisbeeing it. How come my game's not doing that? What the flying fuck? What the hell are you talking about? You just, you just, you, I don't, I don't know what happened. I, do, I didn't do anything. I just went left three times. I've already fucking lost my place. Oh, I, and then, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I forget. I forget already. Oh, I'm going to eat my fucking hand. Add this to worst meltdown of the year. I don't even care. This job, I have to, I'm going to eat my fucking hand. Put it in the oven. No, my God, I'm not pretending. I'm not, I swear to God. Mm. No, I want to just do, no, I want to do. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, I am holding up, holding left. It don't matter. I'm, I'm tilting. I'm dying. I'm like, I'm finessing. I'm, I'm like, you tilting and tilting a little. <laughs> Tilt down. I fell off the fucking edge, dude. I was trying to roll it over to the fucking stupid time. <sighs> ah, don't kill them. Kill them. Kill them. Kill them. Ah! No. Oh! Get this away from my house! <laughs> right there. Bingo. Just land. Holy shit. Okay, I got it. I'm good. I did it. I win. Oh my! Huh? 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 What? 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 Why? What? Oh my god! 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 You followed me, so I'm going back home now. What? He saw us, boss. We gotta try again. What do you mean he saw? Rats. Wait, what? You followed what me, so fuck? I'm going back it's home. Now. This is ridiculous. He saw us, boss. You followed me. So <laughs> I this this oh my god you can't you can't but I'm do you see what's happening you right there how it's made out of the most slippery fucking plastic nope man you see that button you see that shiny plastic ass fucking a button <laughs> cranky wanky right uh, too, too many good ones? There were a lot this year. There was a lot of bad ones. Uh, but there can only be one winner. And I could have guessed this was going to be the one that wins. This is also, uh, not only does this win worst meltdown of the year, it also takes the cake for being the longest stream I've ever done and ever will. Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers. Uh, that was a 13.4, 13 and a half hour stream. It uh, was hell from start to finish. With 24% of the vote. Lord of the Rings, two towers. Underneath that, you have Super Monkey Ball with 19% and then Super Mario Sunshine at 17.7%. Cranky wanky. So there are your uh, winners for Worst Meltdown. And now, we got another match.
Let's move over to the uh, WWE game. <clears throat> Match number four of the evening. Uh, this one, you will be able to bet on. I will just make that really clear. Let me just send the mods what they need to get. You will be able to bet on this one. Let me just tell the mods who it is. I had to write that like six times. Okay, so this is a one-on-one. -on -one. This is going to be a one-on-one -on -one backstage brawl, from what I have heard. Someone's going all in, all in. Oh, be careful. Be careful. One-on-one -on -one backstage brawl. Between none other than, well, you're just going to have to see, aren't you? Just going to have to wait and see for it to load. And I will turn it back on. I will tell you that this is uh, two very powerful beings. We have one of the most powerful current memes on the channel versus the potentially most powerful being on the channel. We're going to have to see. Why don't we take a look right now? Uh... Wait, what? They didn't even They didn't even do it in the entrances! That's <laughs> That's Jerba Dump Truck versus Jex in a one-on-one -on -one backstage brawl? This is like an a horror movie. <laughs> the dump truck versus Jex. I don't know why they're out back and why he's just murdering him out back. Uh, start the prediction, please. Who do you think is going to win this match? Why are they in some weird... Your <laughs> dump truck seems to have all right into the table. <laughs> I hope they use the outhouse to their advantage. Jack's wearing his, uh, his Jack suit, which gives him plus 25. Dirt. Okay, he's already through the table. Your dump truck just dumping on Jack's. Through the table. Jex is, uh, he got so fucked up, he's got gray hair now. What? He just broke his neck? You could, we didn't even have time to, wait, 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 wait. You guys just got so screwed. You guys got so screwed. It happened too fast. He got destroyed. Oh my god. I can't. What am I supposed to do about that? Some of you guys just got absolutely decimated right there. Oh my god. That's so funny. Um, okay. I can't. Alright. That's one. I kind of want. I just. I kind of want to see it again. Oh, wait. Hold on. We'll go back. Alright, we'll go back and do a regular match after. We'll do a regular match after. <laughs> I can't refund. He lost. You guys don't accept anymore. Uh, do you pay out? I mean, uh... alright. No, no. Pull it out. Pull it out. Send the money back. Send the money back. Send the money back. Send the money back. I think. I don't know. I have no idea. This is a horrible scenario. No, pay it out! 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 What happened? Did it do pay out? <laughs> Shit, I don't know, dude. I don't know. I don't know. It was because people could still vote. All right. Listen. Listen. Okay, listen, listen, listen. We're gonna... All right, listen. We're gonna refund the money. We're gonna refund the money, and we're gonna do it again. It happened too fast, dude. Oh, and fade out. <laughs> okay, well, now that you saw that, it's time for a rematch. 
It's too late. Okay, well, whatever. It, we look, it, th shit. That shit's gonna happen. Hey, no, all you guys that just lost right there, here you go. You've got another opportunity because we're gonna do another prediction right now. We're gonna do another one right now. Same match. You know what just happened. Are you, do you think he can do it again? Dump truck is too powerful. I don't. Is he though? Oh, there's like errors <laughs> on predictions. Uh, whatever. Are we ready to do another prediction though? You guys, let's do it again. <clears throat> this is for a German dump truck versus Jex. Same place. And I'm going to give you time now. So you have an opportunity here if you think that jump truck's going to do that again. Or if Jex is going to snap out of it here, lose a little bit of that gray hair, and go for it. What do you guys think? We're going to close the prediction here. Uh, in about, I'd say a minute. One minute, we can maybe close it out. You guys all know what's going to happen. So, are we ready? Are we ready to close it? Have you made your bets? All right. Close that up. Going to start it right now. Okay, are we closed? Am I safe? We press this button. It has to run down the timer. Oh. All right. Well, I don't think that's going to happen again. So I think we have. I think we're good. I'm going to wait till it gets down to like a third. Okay. Now I'm like scared. Okay. Ready? In three, two, one. Go. Oh. Rematch. Right off the bat, Jex with a clothesline. All you have to do, you have to kill your opponent. All you guys that just bet against Jex. Oh, I don't know. You still have an opportunity betting against, but it, we saw Dump Truck kill him in two moves. Just carrying him and dropping him directly onto his onto his big bulbous bunger burger butt. That doesn't hurt him very much. Going over to the trash can here, picking up a sludge hammer. Completely misses. Ankle lock? No, 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 no. He's going to... What is he going to do? Take him right in the chest. They're being a lot more timid this time. They're not, like, instantly hurting each other. So maybe that this is better. Dump truck versus Jex. Right onto the sludge hammer. What, the, what was that sound? That was like somebody getting shocked with a taser. It's like a stun gun. Uh-oh. This does not look good for Jex. Remember, you just have to kill your opponent. With the steel! No, it didn't steal it, but he still hit him with it. That might have killed him. Nope, still alive. Jex is not even transformed, by the way, into Super Jex. He can only do that once every five years. Takes, he's hitting him with a skull. Big reversal by German's dump truck. This looks pretty even. Look at those health bars. This is anybody's match right now. I would love to see an outhouse. I would love to see going over to the outhouse and just like giving him a swirly. Punch, right hand. No, reversal, right elbow. Triple elbow. He hit his head on one of those. He hit his head on one of those. He smashed his head on like a rock or one of those skulls. Completely missing a few times. Dump truck does not have eyes. He's just an ass. Remember, he has to go by smell. I, yep, I just said that. I just did. I'm, and I apologize to 22,000 people. This is looking bad for Jax. That was a neckbreaker on the ground. The neckbreaker always is just deadly. Uh-oh. Jax is in a lot of trouble. 
for the second time in a row, unless he pulls something out right here. Can we get any momentum at all from Jex? He's just getting absolutely destroyed. His health is almost at zero. And he's going to... <laughs> okay, Jex is... <laughs> Jex seems to not... Uh... Man, maybe Jex is getting old too. Oh, no. Is my ass more powerful than the rest of my body at peak pinnacle condition? That's what that whole bit was. Oh, oh well. Ah, oh, that is it. That's open. That's another win. Back to back there from uh, Derma's, uh, Derma's dump truck. <laughs> Time to bring out Super Jex. Who's screaming? All right. That is going to take us, guys, to... Uh, let me lower this. We have the final four categories. They're pretty big ones. <clears throat> we have worst gamer moment, best gamer moment, worst stream of the year, and best stream of the year. Coming up. These are the bottom four categories for uh, the awards, at least. <clears throat> and uh, some of these are pretty close, from what I remember. Yeah. So let's start with... Uh, hold on, let me move this out of the way. I'm, I'm working on it. Relax. Uh, we're going to start with worst gamer moment. Go over here. Did, they, did it pay out? 66 million channel points. My god. 66 fucking million. Okay, pull this back here. I am back. Uh, should I put the New Year thing on? Wait, wait, what time is it? Oh, we have one hour, right? In one hour, I think it's going to line up perfectly. Uh, worst gamer moment of the year. This includes um, just tasks I couldn't do. Uh, bosses I couldn't beat. Things I couldn't do. Basic, uh, basic, literal human, basic human instruction. Uh, not being able to follow. So it's um, just really, really bad, shitty gameplay and ideas that I have over the years. Let's see what the nominees are this year for worst gamer moment of the year. Tape it. I, I could tape it like around my neck. Uh, we got an omega symbol. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. I seriously, what, what? No, I'm not kidding. I don't. I don't fucking know what that is. Explain no, it. omega symbol for real. I don't know that. I have no idea what that is. I have no idea. No, no, you know, you know what fucking omega symbol. Just do the other symbol. Just do the other symbol. I have no idea. Then go to war symbol, you motherfucker. I don't know what to go. I didn't. I played like the first you four hours. God of War. I played the first Jesus. four hours of God of War. I played the that wasn't in the God of fucking War game. Fucking quake symbol. Upside down quake symbol. I Jesus. What, I don't know what all the video games. Fucking symbols trident. Are. <laughs> I can't get this wrong. What the fuck? Oh my god! <laughs> Did you hear how fast I was trying to move the mouse? You have no idea. Okay, if I do not direct hit the next enemy, if I do not hit the next enemy directly, then I will give 500 million community subs. my house <laughs> oh shit it did work or just make the jump. I gotta make this jump. This is the biggest jump of the day. So loud. <laughs> just a regular jump, nothing crazy. Just a regular jump, it gets close. 
Right there. Bingo. Just land. Holy shit. Okay, I got it. I'm good. I did it. I win. Oh my! Huh? 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 What? 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 Why? What? Nice. <sighs> Ride the wall. I don't care. Is that uh, eight? Eight uh, fifty-five? Eight five five? Eight thirty-five? God damn it, man! <laughs> what time is that? <laughs> what time is this? Oh, shit! Eight. <laughs> this is eight thirty-five. People think that they, there's no way that that's real, and I swear to God it was. I, the winner of worst gamer moment of the year, is gonna be. Let me get the audio. Read a clock right now. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me right now. Don't do this to me now, bro. Don't do this to me now, bro. Don't do this to me right now, bro. Don't do it. Don't t don't. Give me a clock. Let's go. Give me a clock right now. Give me a clock. Let's see it. Let's see a clock. You got an analog clock with a time on it? Link it. Link, let me see it. Link me it. Somebody link a clock. Look at the clock. You think I, I, I'm, I'm a millennial. I don't have an analog clock in my house. I have an iPhone. Oh, here we go. Okay, large online clock. Okay, let me save that image. Okay, now I'm gonna read this. I'm gonna read this analog clock right now. This clock says, okay. This is, that is 8, 5, 8, oh, 5 o'clock. What do you mean I cheated? Wait, it's 8, oh, 5 right now. What? Wait, what the fuck is happening? Where did I get this from? You somebody linked this image. <laughs> All right, that's it. Stream's over. The stream is ending right now. Go back to the awards. No, I've. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, worst gamer moment of the year. Uh, 49% of the vote, it was just, a, it was an absolute landslide. Uh, $2.5 billion miss. Uh, with 49% of the vote, an absolute landslide. In second place, it was can't read an analog clock for 10.8% of the vote. And then one DPI Andy for 9.8% of the vote. The debt, by the way, I believe has increased since this, uh, that happened. So, with every worst moment, we also have a best moment, right? You can't have the worst without having the best. Here come the nominees for best gamer moment of the year. And, you know, it's supposed to be gamer moments. If I can't read an analog clock, that's not a gamer moment. That's me having the uh, intelligence quotient of a four-year-old. Right? Here are the nominees. Four. Best Gamer Moment of the Year. <laughs> Here you 
you go, Satan. It's time for you. <laughs> I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Yeah, I'm not even... <laughs> <laughs> You've got the biggest heart of anyone I know. No! Look of love in the dictionary, and there's your picture. Okay, here we go. Get fucking decimated. Get absolutely decimated. I don't even know what your name was. I don't, I, I'm not even gonna read it. I'm not even gonna read it. That was like I was about to get into a car accident. I got him! There's two hands, but I have to push, I have to press this to move out of the way. Use both hands and foot. Don't get next to my chin. I'm getting tired. It's tiring me. Well, I understand. Whoa! 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 Whoa. Was I supposed to jump? <laughs> Holy shit! Somebody said this is not <laughs> impressive at all. <laughs> it's like a regular level. Oh! I'm good. What are you doing? What's that record on that level? What's the record on that level? I want it. What's the world record on that level without ter terms assisted bots? And then they're gonna wrap around. And gonna, okay, I got it. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Okay, here they come. Oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> Used slow doesn't count. <laughs> it's over on a tower. I'm alright, I'm alright, I'm alright, I'm okay, I'm okay. Shit, this, this is gonna be a really hard one. Uh, there's no T's either. Uh, does anyone start with W? Uh, yes, yes, it's true, that could be, could be that. I got w, it. W. The, the word was world. Okay, uh, Simon says. What the fuck? Okay, Simon says. <laughs> Get it! Get up, it's okay, your knee is gonna be fine, honey! Your knee's gonna be fine, honey! I'm still better than you. You got lucky, you little bug. Slam city champion. You got lucky, little bitch. He's got one HP! Come on! Come on! With all of your destructive power! I So somebody made a pretty good point, uh, which is actually very funny. Half of those moments are just sort of normal things that like a good gamer could do. But for us, uh, it's spectacular. The winner of best gamer moment of the year. I'm going to pat myself on the back for this one. I think I did pretty well in this streams. Two of them, right? Uh, the winner is... Hades. Uh, beating Hades, uh, go, not beating Hades, right? Uh, killing Hades the boss on my third attempt. That was 26.6% of the vote. I mean, I think, come on, that that's worth a little bit of celebration. 
just a little. Uh, 26.6%, and then Rhythm Heaven Shooter Pog was 14.9%. Also, I think I gotta give myself some credit for that one. And then, uh, Binding of, I Binding of Isaac God Build to Kill Mega Satan, with 10.8% of the vote, was in third place. Chat sucks at Hades. <laughs> Uh, we have the final two uh, categories here before the Rumble, and we have about 45 minutes before the ball drops in New York. Perfect timing, because everybody is from New York on the Rumble, so that's good. Uh, the last two categories of the year are Worst Stream of the Year and Best Stream of the Year. Two categories that could be a lot in them. Uh, I don't want to accidentally uh, leak who wins. So we're going to start with Worst Stream of the Year. There's a few I could think of, but I don't want to uh, spoil anything for those that may not have seen. Uh, so here we go. Here comes the worst streams that I did in 2020, according to you. I didn't, am I supposed to kill these guys? Let's just say I'm both impressed and annoyed by how sophisticated this Andy Tampa security is. Still working. <laughs> Did I crash? Oh shit! And I think it just needed a few minutes to load. Dude, this looks fine. I'll be back. Give me five minutes. Fucking turn the computer. I'm just turning the computer off. I'm not even gonna turn the stream off. I'm gonna just I'm just turning off the computer. I'm restarting the, I, I, I can't even restart my computer. I on okay. Don't buy this game. This is horrible. Yes, I know. This game is absolute utter dog shit. I know, but I'm at disc four and I'm gonna I'm gonna win. No, I have to go back on full disc. I can't. I don't remember. I don't remember. The, I, I, can you imagine making this game? Oh, just stop. Stop like talking shit and just do it. I'm not. I'm telling you right now. I'm not going back and doing this shit again. I would rather eat my own hand. I'd rather you cut my fucking hand off and put it in the oven and cook it at like 350 for two hours. And I eat it on stream. I'd rather do that than go back and do the like last 45 minutes. Jeremy, you can't play Beautiful Joe. You haven't played VR in so long. Why won't you play VR? Beautiful Joe goes burr. Okay, I have to pay attention. Why do you guys hate this game? Why does everybody hate this? What this game's like fun and exciting and there's like characters and what you guys hate this game? Do you want me to do it again? Wait, somebody's dead. Wait, what? No, it's the tournament. Don't kill each other. <laughs> okay, if a stream is the worst stream of 2020, guaranteed. We can remove it from the list, right? Like, it just, it's, it's, everything else is an honorable mention at this point, right? Oh, shit, I fell through the world. Oh, shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> Please tell me you can see this. I'm killing everybody. Jeremy's torturing his fans. <laughs> oh fuck! I keep, I keep like laughing too much today. I'm, I'm gonna be in pain. Somebody likes this here. Somebody likes this. I know they do. All right, my tongue's been fucked up. Come on, say it. Oh my god. Monka S. Minus 300 viewers. Monka S. 600 people left. It's my fault. No, that's that's on them. 
Guys, for all you know, 600 people just got, like, a fucking call, and they had to get on a phone call. They had to go to, like, the doctor or something, or they yeah, were going to eat dinner, or it was not to go to bed. You don't know it was my fault. I had nothing to do with it. So, yes, um, so, ooh, hold on, here we go. So, yes, sometimes I have bad streams. Sometimes. They can't all be good ones. They, they can't all be good. Sometimes you have to have a couple of stinkers. But, uh, by... No, you don't. Sometimes, sometimes, sometimes. Sometimes. I'm gonna let that slide. It's your birthday. The winner of the worst stream of the entire year of 2020. I mean, d okay, if it's the worst game of 2020, d does that matter? Does that actually matter too? Like, what if it's the worst fucking game that came out in 2020? Watch Dogs Legion. Uh, at 38.5% of the vote, Watch Dogs Legion took that by a lot, but... The Didalis encounter was at 31%. So, really, like, almost 70% of the entire vote was those two streams. So, you have to imagine that those are probably the worst ones. Uh, FTK2 was there at 13.2%, way lower than the 31 from Didalis encounter. So, 70% of you thought those two. I could probably agree. You did tier lists after Watchdog. You did you, you did you did tier lists after Watchdogs. Did I? But, but well, only like a few minutes though, right? What an upset. Well, then it's Die Dallas Encounter. That's the next one. All right, we've made it to the final category of the evening, and it's it's the big one. It's the one that's worth all the money. This one's worth all the cash, all the money. Best stream of the year. I'm going to peek. Might surprise a lot of you. This is probably going to surprise a lot of people here. There's going to be a lot of people that might be angry. A lot of people that might be upset at this, uh, at, at what has happened here. We'll see. It was, very, it was very contested. We'll just say that. Here are your nominees for best stream of the year. Hey, German985 here. Stop moving. Stop! No! I, how do I, I didn't want to kick it! Hey! <laughs> this is good. Try to keep my eye on the road, son. Son, we got a problem here. Son, I'm son! Is that the new waiter that we just hired? I think it is. Oh, the car. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Yeah, and when, when you guys come back, remember, it's me, the fat fuck IRL. Come back next week and I'll shake my stomach around for you more after drinking three Gatorades. All right, now let's play a fun game called Chase Me. I'm not the dog. This is not like dog. I'm not the dog. If you just got in here like a minute ago, sometimes we do this. And he'll just sit here all day and just stare at my face. Hey. Okay, yes. We're gonna get you that new trailer. Come on. <laughs> hey. Jimmy the fish sends his regards. And the fish family. I can't do it. I'll do it. I'll do 30. Oh, shit. I have to stand here. This is handy. He's gonna bust on. He's gonna bust on it. Oh, my God. Oh, no. <laughs> 
Oh, I spewed the shot out of my mouth. I'm all right. I'm okay. Mr. Green, you can't just throw up on the table. I know I can't. But it's, uh, look, I'm helping. Yeah. Mr. Green, you can't take your shirt off. Just give me a second. I'm just throw up all over my shirt. I'm just gonna hold it. I'm gonna hold it. No, 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 no. It's blue. It's blue. What do you mean it's blue? It's just blue. Oh, Don't God. say FRK. Fuck it. Fuck it. Don't um, do that. Okay, press, uh, press and hold it. <laughs> uh, we got an Omega symbol. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Seriously, what, what? No, I'm not kidding. I don't, I don't fucking know what that is. Explain no, me. Omega symbol, for real. I don't know what that, I have no idea what that is. I have no idea. No, no, you know, you know what fucking Omega symbol is. Just do the other symbols, do the other symbols. I have no idea. Then go to war symbol, you motherfucker! I don't know what the, I didn't, I played like the first You're four hours. God of War! I played the first Jesus. four hours of God of War. I played the first, that wasn't in the God of fucking War game. Fucking Quake symbol! Upside down Quake symbol, Jesus! Know what, I don't know what all the video games are. Fucking Trident! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I just broke something. <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. Yeah, Roger, I'm up here in the Channel 5 news chapter, and we're getting word that uh, there, there seems to be some type of altercation going on outside of the McDonald's. Not entirely sure exactly why this is starting. But. I'm getting sources in my ear right now that apparently somebody threw McChicken out the window. Number nine, please. Are the nine anything else? FBI, open up! Alright, I gotta go. I gotta go all the way around. Why are you calling me? Why are you running? Why are you running? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, I, I'm sitting here with the mic being laughing. What's the, uh, what was the, what's the context of the, of like the memes in the background? I forget why, well, during Mario Sunshine, why was that happening? Like the open up, like the, why are you running? Why do I, what was I doing that for? Oh, it's autoplay because I was jingling the keys. Right. Okay. Right, 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 right. Well, anyways. <laughs> the best stream of the year, apparently. Oh, this is going to be contested. People are not going to be happy about this. Well, let's just see what happens. The best stream of the year goes to... Uh, we need... Wait, 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 wait. Play the drums. Play the drums first. With 27.4% of the vote... Long Drive is the winner of the best stream of the year. Beating the auto stream with 19.2% of the vote. Beating all, all those, those two beat Casino Inc. at 11.7. 11.7% for Casino Inc. There, your top three. The auto stream um, didn't win. A lot of people thought that was going to happen. Uh, long drive with 27.4%. And I learned something about this channel. You gotta play more games with just fucking cars in them. Just need to be able to drive a car. Right up to the top of the list. 
Casino Inc. in third. I was surprised by that. I was. Um, so that's it for the New Year's awards. But we now have the main event of the evening. What are we? What we're about to do right now is finish the Germa Rumble 2020 with the actual Rumble. 30 participants. The first Rumble that has been on this channel in like two or three years. And I'm really happy that it could be done and be here for you guys to watch. Because I'm going to enjoy it too. I'm going to be watching right here. So let's take one more break before we're going to count the, the ball down too. We have like about 30 minutes. That might actually happen in the middle of the game. So we'll see. Uh, I'm going to be right back one more time. And when I come back, the rumble will begin. See you guys in just a few minutes. Okay, so it is time for us to do the Rumble. 30 participants enter. Only one can win. Hope you're all prepared. Maybe gotten a, another snack or... And I gotta actually pay attention here because the ball is probably going to drop in the middle of this Rumble. So I need to be able to have like a timer out here. Here we go. Give me a clock. All right, I have access to a clock. 
I do not want to show the game right now because it will spoil everything. So I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to turn it on. Uh, if I can, hold on a sec. I think I'm going to have to resize the window. We'll see. Uh, come on. There we go. Okay, I need to get down here and turn the volume up. Because you guys can't hear it. There we go. Okay. All right, let's go. Are you ready? It is time. The time has come. For the rumble portion. I'm about to turn it on. In three, two, one. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the wrestling portion. You know the rules. If you get thrown over the top rope, you are eliminated. There is no re-entry, and you have a random the number. Contest is the Royal Rumble match. He will now explain everything I the just two explained. That drew number one and number two will start in the ring at the same time. Other superstars will join in the order that they drew. This will continue until all 30 superstars have entered the ring. <laughs> superstars? occur when a superstar is thrown over the top rope with both feet landing on the floor. The last superstar in the ring He's not even talking. will be declared the Royal the animatron Rumble up here and somebody's and doing that from the booth the upstairs. Of their choice at WrestleMania. So who are the first two contestants in the 2020 Rumble? I don't know. We're about to find out. Oh, that would be the cheers to you, CD. First, from New York, Gonna need some of that crowd. Pounds. Hopefully he does a great job. He's really hoping that he, get, the crowd will get behind him for a change. Not him needing to get behind other people. With his audio tape. Damn, cheers to you. We believe in you. <laughs> We believe in you, but you're number one, so you probably won't do it. I will be shocked if you do. Cheers to you. Good luck to you in this competition. So who is number two? First two into the ring at the first moment of the rumble. Here it comes. Are you ready? They're looking for the next contestant. I don't know where the next contestant is. Where? Why are they looking for the next contestant? They're supposed to come down. <laughs> well, no, everyone's excited. Of course they're excited. Because the that's the Mick DLT briefcase guy. From New York, weighing in at 225 pounds. The Superstar! Hailing all the way from 1981 during the pinnacle of the McDLT. The guy in the front row that goes down, drops to one knee with a briefcase in his hand and looks over and says, cool, cool. Hot, hot. Incredibly powerful. And apparently incredibly sweaty. There's the McDLT briefcase guy. I'm talking quarter pound of beef. Why is he out of the ring? Did he just eliminate himself? <laughs> There's a serial killer behind those eyes. Well, I don't know much about that. I, I just know that they're the two that start. USA. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Jerma Rumble 2020. New Year's Eve, don't... Oh, come on. McDLT is my favorite character. McDLT guys are my favorite character. Don't get eliminated instantly. Oh, my fucking God. What the fuck? What? Why? 
Oh, he's my favorite character. <laughs> he's my favorite character. Somebody get in here and just eliminate Cheers to you. Oh, it's the pencil. The pencil is in the 2020 rub. Ah, how is it possible? The most hated character. The pencil was in the rumble. It's been like four years since we've seen the pencil. And cheers to you, as just has so much power, so much strength. He, and nobody can even touch him so far. Oh my goodness, a huge clothesline onto the pencil. Oh, we're gonna fill this ring up a little bit here. Someone's coming in at about 10 dots. Good, a sweeping kick to the groin there. Pencil has started to dominate. And of course, Glue Man coming in next. Glue Man is your number four. There he is. In all of his glory. With his Boston Celtics boots. As the pencil rakes his eyes. Glue Man now stuffed into the corner. Takes two or three punches. Didn't even get a chance to show everybody. Now he's going to reverse it. Cheers to you taking a breather here. After instantly eliminating my favorite character, can the pencil be removed? Pencil is a former champion of the Rumble, by the way. Really important for you to know. I think they're going to double team. They are not going to double team. Dr. Smoikson coming in next at number five. As they're going to... Oh. What? No, oh, that doesn't count. Is Glue Man eliminated? Is Glue Man... <laughs> What's going on? What the fuck? Okay, Glue Man is not eliminated. Dr. Smoikson comes in. We now got four competitors into the Rumble. A lot of you guys probably would hate to see the pencil win again, so would I. The crowded ring, here it comes. Who is going to be number six? Toss him over. Toss him over. Oh, it's Germa Thing. Germa Thing. Oh, fucking cool. Germa Thing coming in from the game, The Thing. Let's see if we can get a good view of his face. Glue Man. Oh, you're never going to win, man. Glue Man's just never going to win. We all have to be completely honest with ourselves. He's just, he's a lovable loser. I'm sorry, Glue Man. It doesn't matter if I give you a hundred in every stat. You're going to get thrown out in the first five minutes. Cheers to you is still holding strong. Well, German thing. Maybe not for long, though. We'll see. I can't believe I'm seeing. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. Gabe Newell is coming in next. And they're going to double team eliminate him, possibly. Cheers to you looking and he's got a valve index on. He didn't even instantly eliminates Dr. Schmutz and Gabe Newell is back and he is angry for not being invited for the last three or four years in a row. Showing off that index. Dr. Smoikson taking a huge Oh what is he doing? Dr. Smoikson Dr. Smoikson just breathed in his own hand. I think that was weird. But Gabe Newell is looking for redemption in this rumble. If you remember the pencil in Gabe Newell. Had a huge rivalry, and it looks like it's going to continue here as he gets dropped onto the top turnbuckle there. Number eight coming in is Jigsaw with the gas. The Jigsaw doll. Derma Thing on the edge of the ropes there. Derma Thing's going to get eliminated. Oh, he's not. He holds on for his dear life. The pencil is going to eliminate. Oh, it's, it's going to... <laughs> it. We didn't get to see his face. Cheers to you is still in it. He was the first competitor, by the way. He got instantly gassed. Who's coming to exit number nine? We got Pac-Man. Pac-Man has entered the rumble. <laughs> Gabe Newell is still doing very well. He's still got good green health. If I were him, I would go over in that corner. I would open up Half-Life Alex, and I would start Chapter 1. What a great game that was, and what a great thing. And going after Pac-Man's back here. We're going to have six competitors in the ring, and of course, Long Drive Dad is going to make an appearance. He won Best Stream of the Year. Why wouldn't Long Drive Dad make an appearance? Can he sweep another category? Called winning the rumble. Big DDT there. Ring's getting crowded. Yeah, it is. Cheers to you. Still in it. Big right hook onto long drive. Are they going to fill more people in here? Do not let this rivalry end this way, Gabe. 
No, 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 no. It can't end like this. It can't end like this. Oh, Gabe Newell holds on for dear life as Travis Touchdown comes in. Making his way in. Can't wait for that new game. Going to be playing that new game as Travis Touchdown comes on in. Cheers to you. Did Cheers to you. It's gone. Long drive dad has eliminated cheers to you. The longest person inside the ring so far. We made it 30% of the way through. But sorry. We didn't win. It's now Gabe Newell has got long drive dad. Gives him the groin drop. Long drive dad's going to get tossed out by Gabe Newell. He's got extra strength so far. And who's coming in now? This is... Fortnite Jimmy's coming in next. Fortnite Jimmy on his way in as, as Gabe Newell and the Pencil both try to eliminate Long Drive Dad. <laughs> we were talking shit and he's ready to go. It doesn't matter. I mean, it doesn't matter. I mean, he's, he's, he's only 13 and he really shouldn't be in here with a bunch of grown like 44 year olds and like 29 year olds, but um, like whatever, it's okay. It's a full ring right now. Reversal by German Thing onto German Pencil. That's not a German Pencil. That's just the pencil. He sucks. No eliminations. Somebody has to get eliminated. That's a fake out from German Thing. If I've ever seen one. I told you. Long Drive Dad's going out right here. No, he got distracted by Travis. Touchdown. Long Drive lives again to see another minute here. Pencil <laughs> Fortnite Jimmy, Fortnite Jimmy, like in math class, threw his pencil down after getting a 100 on it. Oh, long drive, Dad. He's dealt with. He's here. He has kids of his own. He's upset about that one. He is a dad, for God's sake. No, he can't eliminate him. As German 985 enters the arena, but no, long drive, Dad cannot eliminate Fortnite Jimmy. But Germa, Germa with a full body cast on. 2020's been a little rough on German 985, but he still has got the strength of at least 10 people. He still has the strength. <laughs> Long drive, Dad. Long drive, Dad. Needs to be free. Oh my God. So he's stopping. <laughs> Backman just absolutely just drops. Down an elevator shaft, German 985. You weren't gonna win, man. You're at like 60% still. <laughs> Travis Touchdown now is in a lot of trouble with Gabe Newell. Travis Touchdown is stuck on the ropes. Somebody get Travis Touchdown out of here. I can't, man. <laughs> Fortnite Jimmy's just. Long drive dad in the corner, the right hand side corner. Travis touched on trying to get rid of him. No, he cannot do what is necessary to throw him over. Pac Man still with a lot of HP. Lots of health still. Jeremy Thing's been in here for a long time. Gabe Newell's been in here for a long time. And somebody else is about to enter while Gabe Newell's in, and Nancy Drew's coming in hot here. Earlier this evening. Nancy Drew won the crew battle. Drew crew prevailed, and obviously she's celebrating for it. Big suplex here on Fortnite Jimmy by Germa Thing. Yeah, Drew crew has uh, taken a few wins today, and that's it for Fortnite Jimmy. Germa Thing freaked out. And then another elimination. Gabe Newell just destroys Long Drive Dad. People are going to be really upset by that one. Gabe Newell on the hunt here. Maybe going for a second elimination in a row. Nancy Drew with a big boot. Getting some taunting by Gabe Newell. I'm not sure what, what he's doing here, but he's... Maybe they're going to work together and try to eliminate Travis Touchdown while German Thing's in a lot of trouble. And incoming next is from Lord of the Rings. You know him as the Dwarf. Here comes Gimli. Nancy Drew, that's a really bad place to be right now. You don't want to be taunting up there. And my axe. And my... What's going on with his hair? His hair is a life of its own. 
big maneuver, big double punch into the elbow drop right on the top of the skull. Gabe Newell is just working on to Gimli. For some reason, Gabe Newell has it out for the Lord of the Rings. Huge elbow drop. Wait, what? Pac-Man has been eliminated. Pac-Man has been eliminated from the Rumble, and Travis Touchdown might be right after. Oh, no. Oh, no. Gabe Newell has just been eliminated by German Thing, and so has Travis Touchdown. We are getting down to the to the few here. Nancy Drew. You got to get rid of Nancy Drew. She's currently running on the high of her victory with the Drew crew. I think Gimli and German Thing have to work together here and get her out of here. Unfortunately, Gabe Newell could not get the redemption that a lot of you think he may have deserved. But it's okay, his wall dad's coming in. An older competitor from the last Rumble. Wall dad. Going right. Oh, no. What a reversal by Nancy Drew. What is German Thing doing? He's just pulling his hair? He's not going to just... <laughs> He is wild. He is very wild and untamed. Is Gimli going to get dropped here? No, not quite. Not quite. Next competitor is, of course, a jar of mayonnaise. One of the most delicious snacks. One of the most delicious additives you could possibly put on any food product. It's good on french fries. It's good on turkey sandwiches. It's really good in tuna, if you make like a tuna sandwich. Jar of mayonnaise. It'll, and a little goes a long way, by the way. You don't have to use a whole lot. It's really good on some other stuff, too. It's good. Wait, hold on. We got some action here. Gimli is about to eliminate Germa Thing. Is Waldad going to let this happen? He is. There he goes. That is the end for Germa Thing. And here comes a pasta Italiano chef from Casino Inc. Fuck, somebody said, fuck Nancy? <laughs> Pasta Italiano, chef. You don't know, they've had plenty of, uh, plenty of really bad things happen to their restaurant and to them. Always the subject of, uh, attacks and, uh, mob hits. But here now to try to, uh, use some of their own firepower. That was a really, really big move by the jar of may uh, mayonnaise. And BF Bugleberry is now number 19 coming in. Please don't all of you leave. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Going right for Wall Dad. It's going to be an instant. Yeah, there he goes. <laughs> that was very violent from BF Bugleberry. Trying to get rid of the jar of mayonnaise. Nancy Drew and BF Bugleberry working together. And, nope, he's, he's very thick. He's very full of vitamins and minerals. You can't just get rid of mayonnaise that quickly. Don't pour it down the drain either. Throw it in the, you gotta, you gotta like scoop it up and throw it in like the trash and stuff. It can't go down the drain. Beanbag Sonic has just entered the rumble. And he's grown up now. He's not just a little shit anymore. He's a huge, muscly, fully evolved level 10 Monster Rancher Monster. It's been quite a while since we've seen Beanbag Sonic. He's been training. And there goes the Pasta Italiano Chef by Gimli. Gone almost as fast as he came in. And here comes Mr. Green. What is the Jar of Mayonnaise doing? Mr. Green coming in. Looks like he lost his pants uh, in a game of poker. But he's here. There goes <laughs> BF Bugleberry gets dumped over and Nancy Drew gets eliminated. Oh no. I had high hopes for Nancy Drew. I thought she was going to go a long way, but Mr. Green is on an absolute tirade here. He was so strong. He just picked up a level 10 Monster Rancher, fully developed monster, and just threw it like it was a fucking piece of cheese. Gimli is still sticking around. Look at that health, though. Not doing well. Oh, nope. What are they doing? <laughs> what the fuck 
was that? What was that? And here comes Chuck E. Cheese at number 22. Big power bomb on Mr. Green from the jar of mayonnaise. Chuck E. Cheese, everybody's favorite rat. Well, not everybody's favorite rat. I don't, not, not really, I don't think anyone's favorite rat. I could probably name a few that go in front. Um, Jerry from Ratatouille. The giant rat that makes all the rules. Um, Tom, no, Jerry from Tom and Jerry. Who else? In Wallace and Gromit, there's that one, uh, there's that one rat short. It's a mouse, but whatever. Welcome Chuck E. Cheese to the Rumble. I hope you get instantly eliminated. And Murius is at number 23. We're getting down to the final eight. Final seven coming in here. Oh boy, would you love to see a Murius Gerba Rumble 2020 win. I'll tell you, that's a good New Year's Eve present for me. One of my favorite characters. Yeah, Chuck E. Cheese is getting stomped by Gimli. Gimli, by the way, is still in here. There goes Mr. Green by the Jar of Mayonnaise. Jar of Mayo looking to be a pretty high seed here. And also representing the Wink Dinks. Here comes Jerma Wink. Saw him lose earlier tonight, but that's okay. Still coming in to represent for the Rumble. No, god damn it, Gimli. Fuck. No, why he's so good. All right, there's only one opportunity where I'm going to say Chuck E. Cheese is better than Lord of the Rings, and it's right now. This is the only time you'll ever hear me say that. Get rid of Gimli. He's doing too good. Darameo is just taking a little breather here. Who's number 25? Seaman. Here he comes. From the Dreamcast. Seems to be also a full-grown adult and not just a little baby uh, tadpole anymore. Beanbag Sonic with a big suplex. Yeah, this is what you gotta get rid of Gimli. You know, get hey Dink, hey you fucking Dink, get rid of Gimli together. He's he's like the top seed right now. You want it, Chuck E. Cheese? Come on, go for it, go for it, go for it. G. Red is... There he goes. Thank God for Chuck E. Cheese. G. Red from Gotcha Force is the next competitor. If he comes in, I, for some reason, he's not coming down. Somebody needs to, like, turn the toy on. There he is! The strongest of all the Gotcha Bots. We have G. Red. Okay, already already showing that he is very strong. Okay, he's, oh my god! The gotcha force has made it to the Germa Arena! And he's also, weirdly enough, weirdly enough, he is about four inches tall. But in the Germa Rumble universe, he is like eight feet tall. And what's that I see at number 27? What's that I see at number 27? That is Catboy Germa! Catboy Germa making their appearance for the first time in the Germa Arena. Just trying to see who to attack, who to scratch, who to bite at. Going right for Beanbag Sonic. What an excellent idea. Catboy Germa. No, gets reversed. Seaman, got your red. Catboy Germa, Beanbag Sonic. A jar of mayonnaise and Chuck E. Cheese are your... Potential final competitors. Potential final competitors. Catboy Germa's got the upper hand on Beanbag Sonic. Beanbag Sonic, you yeah, you got it. You got to do something. You got to reverse it. There's a reversal there. Chuck E. Cheese uh, just like choked himself. Double punch there onto. <laughs> they're just punching each other. Who comes in at number 29? Oh, number 28. That would be an Andy Mark robot from the carnival stream. Also dressed as the goat to Andy Mark for all your robot needs. You got a project going on? Andy Mark, they're the ones. Coming right into the jar of mayonnaise. They both have the same like color scheme. This is gonna get really interesting because th this is it. 
after two what the hell is going on jar mayonnaise has a bunch of awesome moves Capo german no did not fall off with the top ropes and derma's derma's dump truck one of the final competitors we could see an upset here this could be very upsetting oh gotcha red coming in and there goes the jar of mayonnaise unfortunate very unfortunate but there he is why did the uh, gotcha red just run over the ropes to eliminate himself no he's still in what was that Catboy Germa into the into the turnbuckle as Chuck E. Cheese now trying to get some work done. Germa's dump truck. Gotcha red. Holy shit, it's almost midnight. Uh, what time is it? Wait, 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 wait. It's almost midnight Eastern. I don't even have the song queued up. The ball's dropping right now. Catboy Germa playing to the crowd. Is, the ball's going to drop like right now. Here it comes, here it comes, here it comes. Did Andy Mark just got eliminated? Oh no, the Andy Mark robot. <laughs> the, the power of, of 100 asses. No, Gotcha Red's still in the fight. And is it New Year yet? Not yet, not yet, not yet. About 35 seconds. One of these is going to be the winner of your 2020 Rumble. You understand? One of these is your winner. Catboy Germa. Trying to get Seaman into the corner. No, he throws him right into Gotcha Red. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Happy New Year, everybody! And the final contestant of the night is Juggles, the greatest streamer. Juggles, the great, is your final competitor. Looks like he's got a full belly. Sitting in his underwear. And who did Catboy German just eliminate? Who just got eliminated? Seaman just got eliminated by Catboy German. And goodbye, Catboy German. Gotcha, Red. With a major big elimination there. Oh, high hopes for Catboy German, but it didn't happen. Unfortunately. And Juggles the Great comes right and gets a DDT. And Derma's dump truck is just like splitting that ass right on the turnbuckle. He don't care. Nice twisting arm flexing smash glass breaking attack. Onto Chuck E. Cheese as Gotcha Red. Juggles the Great It's going to be shaking him up here over the top turnbuckle. No, I don't think he can do it. He's not strong enough. Not strong enough. Gotcha Red is still holding on for dear life. And he still has pretty decent health. His health is pretty good. It's going to be really hard to eliminate Gotcha for us. G Red. Greatest GameCube game ever made. And it's also the most expensive. It's like $300 to buy that game. Goodbye Beanbag Sonic. That's it. That was such an opportunity. That's such a disappointment. Huge disappointment. Mean bag Sonic is out. Uh, this looks like it's going to come down to G Red and somebody. Juggles the Great going for a big punch. Not enough to knock him down, though. Chuck E. Cheese just overhead through. <laughs> Wait, what? He just did it twice. He just pulled him back, yunked him back, and did it again. Your final three competitors are Chuck E. Cheese, Gotcha Red, and Juggles the Great. This is anybody's fight here. Oh, no. Gotcha Red with a big comeback. He's going to dump him. G. Red. Is he going to just sit there and let him do it, or is he going to break it up? I don't know. 
No, he's, it's not enough to dump Chuck E. Cheese. Here it is. Beanback Sonic in the background. Here are your final three. Who could be crowned the 2020 champion of the 2020 Derma Rumble? Chuck E. Cheese is going to get dumped here, and it's going to be... it's. <laughs> no? Is he going to let him do it? Is Chuck E. Cheese going to fight back? Come on, Chuck E. Cheese. No! There goes Chuck E. Cheese. A competitor has been eliminated. Juggles the Great and G. Red. Douglas the Great is the last person to come in. Let's see if G. Red can... Oh, my God! I thought he was going to throw him directly over the ropes. Did you see? You see the momentum. You see the excitement in that grab. He's going to prove to everybody once and for all that this was worth streaming and that it was a great game. Is he going to do it? Can he dump him? Can he dump Juggles? Is G-Red going to win the Rumble? No, it's not enough Juggles with the reversal. Oh no, he's getting slow. He's slowing down. It's going to take a miracle. Big belly-to-belly -belly suplex, but Juggles is red too. Uh-oh, he's going for the fucking belly shake. <laughs> or the, he's going for the human brick. Oh, no. <laughs> he just keeps doing it. Three, that's three belly shakes. Three belly shakes in a row, but wait a minute. Wait a minute! He... He reversed it! Huge clothesline! Gotcha, Red! He's got only 2% battery left on his fucking phone! Please plug it in for God's sakes, you're killing us! I'm sick of you sending me screenshots with 4% battery, dude, please! Could this be the end? Big reversal by Juggles. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. He, can he? He's. No! He, he's still holding on for dear life. G Red has no HP left. He's just floating there. It's gonna happen. It's over. It's over. It's over. No! No! You can't let him do this to you. G Red, that's it! Juggles, number 30. Bastard comes in at the very end. Oh, I really thought he was going to pull it off. Too bad. Too bad. Juggles the Great is your 2020 German Rumble winner. I mean, you can't come back from three. Massive Gatorade fold stomach. Frog splashes. It's, just not, it's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. You got to be realistic. Juggles the Great. Uh, is your winner, unfortunately. <clears throat> unfortunately, I really was rooting for Gotcha Red. <laughs> I want the Catboy Germa timeline. <clears throat> you want to do another one? Encore? For fun? We'll just, we'll, yeah, just for fun, watch it. Ah, oh, G Red got robbed. They really did. <clears throat> Encore? Just one more for fun? <clears throat> I just like blew my voice out. Yeah, let's do it again. Why not? Let's do it for fun. I can't believe the McTeal the McDLT briefcase guy. He got eliminated instantly. I want the McDLT briefcase guy to win so bad. Double or nothing? Uh no, no. That one is the one. This one's for fun. Send in the green screen. <laughs> A happy New Year, guys. <clears throat> happy New Year. Wait, it's the, the same exact thing? Wait, it's not going to do the same exact stuff, right? 
Is the same exact participants coming in? Yeah, we got wait, 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 wait. We gotta shuffle this. Yeah, we, we gotta shuffle this. We can't have the whole thing happen. Alright, give me a sec. What do you think? Should we add you wanna add a couple of Ritz brothers? What do you think? Add uh, add uh, Majima and Kiryu. Okay, we'll we'll add, hold on, yeah we'll just just watch me do this. All right, so no, nah, it doesn't really matter who comes in first. What do you think? We'll add. I mean, Beanbag Sonic. You can do random. That's good. All right, participants. Let's add everybody. Uh, should we add Big Banana? <laughs> you see like this, stats. <laughs> Big Banana go in? Alright. By the way, this is not the order. This is, I'm just putting people in. Fortnite. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Andy Mark's already in it. Okay, let's go like this. <clears throat> Put the green screen in. Uh, the green screen is not in this game. Uh, this is, I got 2020. This is not 2018 anymore. Which is kind of funny because 2018 uh, is probably like a better game. What about Glue Man? Yeah, I'll put him in. Just make him. Make him now. Leave Roman Reigns in. <laughs> no, why? Just make a big green guy that's like has a hundred and all stats. <laughs> uh, Jex is already in. True. Right, let's put one of the Ritz brothers in it. Let's put Al Ritz in it. Why not? <clears throat> please, Jerma. Please do it. Do it now. Where was he? Why was he not in the rumble? What? I was wondering. Th there are two or three people that were missing. Who else was missing from the rumble? Oh, no longer counts. We didn't have all the competitors. Oh shit! Uh, that's no. That's accurate. I, yeah, I was wondering. I was like, "What? Wait, what happened? What happened to Joel? I like, made Joel and like put him in." <sighs> yeah, it's time for a rematch. I hope Joel fucking wins now. <laughs> oh, you know what it was? It's probably because Wink Dink was not supposed to be in the Rumble. That was supposed to be Joel because they already had their match. So yeah, that's what happened. Uh, all right, what do you, with the, obviously long drive, dead. What about cat boy? I know, I'm, I'm getting to it, I'm getting to it. No, Roman Reigns is not staying in. What about Max in? Gotta put the pencil in. Get Gimli out. Gimli out? Should I throw out Gimli? Put him in Jima? <clears throat> yeah, get rid of... Yeah, German Wink was not supposed to be there. Okay, does this look good? Remove the jar of mayo. He eliminated like five people. It was really good. I think that looks good. Now just, you know, just remove me for Gimli. Seriously. DLT briefcase guy's a hundred. And what about it? 
But you don't think that he's like one of the strongest people here? What are you talking about? Uh, is that seriously a question that you're asking? Put Germa back in. <clears throat> Remove the Ritz brother. All right, fine. Take Juggles out. He already won. Eh, that's a good idea. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, Travis touchdown, Pac-Man, or Sam or Max? Or Kiryu? Travis touchdown. Get the pencil out. All right, get the pencil out of here. Fuck this guy. Put Kiryu in. <clears throat> and... Big Banana? I think this is good. This is fine. This is all right. This is good. <clears throat> no, I want to watch that fucker get snapped in two. Well, th this is good. What about Pac-Man? Uh, we can get rid of Jigsaw. He, he, he was shitty. He came in and got eliminated instantly. We'll put, uh, we'll put Max in instead of Jigsaw. I mean, it's hard to, to uh, there are too many characters here. What about Murius? Oh shit, that is like my favorite character. All right, uh, I'm gonna trade. I can't trade Dr. Schmeissen. I'm not getting rid of Catboy Germa. What are you, nuts? I don't know, I can't remove anybody. Get rid of the Pasta Italiano Chef. Get rid of mayo. I like the mayo. It's like my favorite food. I think this is good. I think this is all right. I'm okay with this. Get rid of Fortnite Jimmy. No. Get Gimli out of here. <laughs> all right. I'm going to... Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of Kiryu. We're going to have only one person represent the franchise, right? We'll put Murius in. Uh, we're going to get rid of... Sam is not here, right? And then we're going to get... Yeah, yeah. fuck Gimli. Get him out of here. Uh, Pac-Man? Yeah, Pac-Man. That looks good to me. That looks good to me. Let's go. Uh, we'll enter... Let's turn entrances off. We don't need it. Uh-huh. Okay. Here we go. Let's move. Jigsaw? No. He's dead. He got knocked over the top rope and landed on his head. He's, he's not coming back. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> Here comes the redo. Well, not really redo. More of a an encore. Jigsaw is going to have fun in... Uh, looks like Mr. Green and Germa Thing are the first two contestants in the ring. And in all these WWE games, uh, if you're not in the last, like, 10 to 15 people, you're not going to win. So enjoy the time they have in here now, because they're going to be gone in about two to three minutes. But that's Mr. Green and that's Germa Thing. No green screen? Well, look at he's green. Just imagine he was the green screen. He's usually one of the last four. Yeah, usually. Uh, Andy Mark Robot. Andy Mark Goat. Again, these are the these are the guys that did the carnival stuff. They made all the carnival robots, which were incredible. Everybody loves Andy Mark. Trying to get rid of Mr. Green. And they do. Nobody fucks with Mr. Green. Unless it's multiple people fucking with Mr. Green. And he gets thrown. God damn it. I want him in like the final 10. Uh, how do I give him like extra points? The McDLT briefcase guy is in. At number four. I mean, they all have good stats. The only one that didn't have good stats was... Um, I think Fortnite Jimmy has like under 70. 
I think he's the only person. A hundred stats. <laughs> no, he doesn't have a hundred stats. Dave Newell at number five. You should play long drive again. <laughs> Who had the most eliminations? Like, cheers to you? Cheers to you eliminated at least three or four people, at least. Nice DDT onto the ropes by the McDLT briefcase guy. Long drive two. Well, I mean, I kind of have to. We won best stream of the year, but that's kind of scary. Because what if it, you guys thought it was so good? What if the sequel's not good enough? What if I play that game again and stream it and it's just, I, I'm just not, it's not as funny. It's going to get multiplayer soon. Oh shit, nice. What the hell was that? Yeah, I feel like lightning struck. I don't know if uh, lightning can strike twice. Uh, Gabe Newell going for an elimination here on Andy Mark. Jeremy Thing getting involved. And there's the dump. See you later. Andy Mark and Pac-Man by the McDLT briefcase guy. G-Red coming in. G-Red making the appearance for the second time. Almost won the quote-unquote official one. But we can have more than one. They can be two official winners, right? Big power bomb. That was huge. Pac-Man got ghosted. <laughs> yeah, he was gone instantly, huh? BF Bugleberry at number eight. You know, I'd really love to see Gabe Newell win. I really would. He was in all the original ones. He always got so close. I'd love to see a, a Gabe Newell victory here. Or or a Catboy one. <laughs> I would love to see a German Catboy Rumble victory. <laughs> Catboy. <laughs> Big suplex from Gabe Newell onto German Thing. As Chuck E. Cheese coming up at almost number 10. <laughs> hey, there was also a pretty equal chance that Chuck E. Cheese was going to win too. So why you tell me what's worse. And there he goes. There he's gone. And my favorite character. He's got a fucking hundred in every stat. That's how you know that it doesn't matter. He has almost 100 in every step. Are they going to dump Gabe Newell? Uh, what's the worst outcome? Chuck E. Cheese or... Is Chuck E. Cheese almost won? Here comes Max. Catboy is the worst outcome. Every time this ticks up and it's not Catboy is a higher chance at a Catboy Rumble victory. Or even a BF Bugleberry victory, because look, he's still there. Chuck E. Cheese on the ropes. Max. <laughs> I love Max. Max looks so funny. German Thing looks really funny, too. German 985 in his full body cast. Come on out. Let's see what you can do. Am I going to win? Can I win? <laughs> what was that? Germa Thing. How much health does Germa Thing have? He's okay. He's going to powerbomb over the top rope. Max is fucked. <laughs> See you later. Is he going to go for Chuck E. Cheese too? Oh, I don't know. Dr. Schmoitzen coming at number 12. <laughs> Good doctor.
Germa Thing has pretty low HP, but he's still there. <laughs> Just hammering on the back of Chuck E. Cheese right in his spine. Dump him. Dump him. Get rid of him. Get Chuck E. Cheese out of here right now. Because no, get like, get, yes, please. No, okay. It, it didn't work. Yes, it is. They're both trying as hard as they can. <laughs> Did he spit on him? Did he just get spit on? Big scoop up by G Red. <laughs> oh fuck! I'm getting I'm getting a little zonked. Why are they lying on top of each other? <laughs> Wait, what happened? <laughs> Wait, why are they all lined up together? <laughs> They're lying down like sardines. <laughs> Long drive, Dad coming in. Takes a headbutt from the biggest mouse I've ever seen. <laughs> Everybody's favorite character is about to go. Buy Chuck E. Cheese, of course, instantly. Or Gabe Newell, which everybody likes Gabe Newell. Chuck E. Cheese, you maniac. Absolute maniac. EF Bugleberry with a sliding tackle. The Na Drew crew is better than Catboy crew. Um, that's a debate that you guys can have here. <laughs> Bugleberry going to the top rope. What is he going for? Oh my god, and I was I right in my chest, really? Really, Bugleberry? You gonna, like, you gonna kick a man when he's down? Really? Get him out. Throw him out of here. Oh! <laughs> he felt my anger. He could feel it. German 985. Letting the adrenaline take over. Little does everybody know that after this adrenaline wears off, he's going to be off for about three and a half months. But at least he might be able to pull the victory. Is uh, Dr. Smokeson going down? What just happened to Gabe Newell? Is that a punch or is that a... <laughs> He's just punching him in the face over and over again. Can I get rid of Chuck E. Cheese too? I'm, I'm fucking angry right now, guys. Look at my face. I mean, absolute business right now. Holy shit. No, no, G Red's putting a stop to that right now. Oh, it's gonna—he's gonna dump. He's gonna dump me. He's gonna dump me. Gabe Newell, please get up and help me. All right, okay. Come on, Gabe, get up and help. No, no, I mean like help me. I'm gone. See you later. Still fought it off somehow. <laughs> you kidding me? Why is I just standing there? <laughs> oh shit! Gabe Newell has been eliminated by a huge lariat by long drive down. And here comes Joel Varg Skeletor! Big elimination on G Red! First time we've seen a crossover here on this channel. Representing Vine Wrestle. Joel! Vine sauce, Joel. I, I don't know what happened. <laughs> that was like too many. Are they double teaming? German thing is still in this. German 985 is also still in this. And so is Dr. Schmoikson, who's been here for a while as well. Big slap by German thing onto Joel. He's looking for a place to dump me. That's what this is. Oh, no. No, no. Don't let the doctor eliminate you. <laughs> no one's throwing me out, man. I'm staying in this for a long time. Big stunner! 
can't capitalize, but they cannot follow up with it. And then Pasta Italiano coming in. The chef from that delicious, fine establishment. Just flipped it up like a pancake. Juggles coming in. If Juggles is 30 again, I'm going to be pissed. I'm going to be so mad. Murius the Cow from the Drew Crew. I mean, the Moo Crew. Joel, what happened? Did Joel get just a... What? Why was that like times two speed? That was weird. Joel just got eliminated by Dr. Schmoitzen. Do a thing. With another attempt on long drive, Dad. Uh, but thank you, Joel, for joining us. At the Germa Rumble 2020. Beanbag Sonic coming in next. I thought I, Joel, I, I thought Joel was going to be in it for a while. I'm surprised. You can't like stick him with those horns. Dr. Schmoikson completely misses. Completely. I don't even know what he was punching. But, and now he's in trouble. Beanbag Sonic in a good spot, by the way. Coming in. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. He just ran out of the way. Italiano is gone. <laughs> you threw him so hard that he is continuing to run by himself on his own. Jesus. Beanbag Sonic absolutely crushing it right now. Eliminates two people in a row. There goes German985. Eliminated. Four fan favorites are in the ring right now. Just want to make that clear. There goes Long Drive Dad, and in comes Glue Man at number 18. Is this the opportunity for Glue Man to at least get a win here? Is this the opportunity? So far, not so good. This is the spot you want to be in. It's going to be one of these people here. I, you know what? All right, here you go. I think gonna, uh, Beanbag Sonic's going to win this, I think. Really good position. Just kind of just beat up the horse, the cow. Travis touchdown is number 19. Still no sign of German Cat Boy. Which I think is concerning a lot of you. By the way, anybody see Travis Touchdown's shirt? Get a good look right now. Anybody know what that is? <laughs> a competitor has been eliminated. That is Catboy Germa on that shirt. Yes, you are right. Here comes Majima at number 20. Good place to be in. Germa Thing is gone. Big right hands by Murius onto Beanbag Sonic. Looks like Majima's going to finish the job with some shin kicks. No, he's going to get from behind Glue Man. He's going to keep just punching him over and over and over again in the corner. <laughs> what did you do? What did you do? Why did you do that? Oh, shit. <laughs> Big banana. He's just, I can't even talk. He jumped over him and went way too high and flew over the ring. There goes Travis touchdown. Majima with an elimination. Uh, but big, big banana bro is in here in a good place. Blue man though. Glue man's ear. Glue man's ear. It could be. Jex is coming in at 22. Nice backflip by Majima. Holy shit. Did you see that? That was unbelievable. 
We got Jex, though. Why is Jex already at, like, half health? Did he fall down on the way in here? Big Banana Bro looks like he's going to be throwing up Majima. No, they both want to get rid of Majima. Very strong character, very strong competitor. Not going to happen this time. Jar of Mayonnaise is coming in at 23. Oh, boy. Y'all want this to be the cannon one. You sure? A jar of Mayonnaise coming in. <laughs> Drew crew, that's possible. Juggles is also possible. No, he's not. He's gone. Get mayo out of here. The more that I look at that container, the more that I want to eat something with mayonnaise on it right now. Fortnite Jimmy at number 24. The more I look at that jar, I just want like mayonnaise on. So I want like a turkey sandwich with, with mayo all over it. It's a backflip shin hit. Verb noun. I'm just saying, I'm saying like the, the, the body part that it happened and where they hit. Shin head hit. There goes Majima by Fortnite Jimmy. Catboy Jerma at number 25. It's possible. It's possible for a Catboy Cannon win. Too early? I don't know. It could, it's, it could, whoever comes in over the next five, it's very possible. Catboy eliminating Murius. Oh no, there he goes. Murius, my favorite character. Besides McDLT briefcase guy. Still going after Fortnite, Jimmy. Nice reversals from Banana Bro. What is that? Is that a fanny pack on his back? There goes Jex, eliminated by Glue Man. Glue Man's year could be this year. He could win at least one, even if it's the Encore. Stop the Catboy. Anything but Catboy. Stop the Catboy. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Uh oh, Fortnite Jimmy's in trouble. He's going to get tossed over by German Catboy. Look at the health on Catboy German, by the way. Uh oh. <laughs> Jar of Mayonnaise still can't get eliminated, even with two people trying to push him down. Holy shit, that was brutal. <laughs> Dude, what is going on here? <laughs> Just pancaked. Glue Man is on the ground in bad, bad state right now. Wall Dad coming in at 26. <clears throat> no, protect Fortnite Jimmy. <laughs> Alright, Dad going after Fortnite Jimmy. Let's see. Is Glue Man going to stay in? Yeah, he is. Glue Man's still here. It's possible. It could be the year. No, keep him in. He's going to turn. He's got. Oh, oh, he's okay. Cheers to you, CD, coming at 27. Uh, yeah, if Glue Man's going to turn to the Undertaker. He's going to get to be like 74 years old and still be wrestling. But the difference is the Undertaker won WrestleMania like 30 times. Glue Man has done nothing. Boy, play wall dad eliminated by Fortnite Jimmy? Really? Wow, okay. That's unexpected. Oh, Fortnite Jimmy is pissed. He's full of G Fuel. He's full of fucking monster energy drinks and Snickers bars. Oh, shit. No. <laughs> I 
Nancy Drew coming in at 28. We've got two different crew. This is crew matchup rematch again. Oh, I really wanted Mayo to win. If I had to pick somebody in this ring, it'd be Mayo or Glue Man. Or Nancy Drew. I've seen a lot of Banana Bros. People looking for the Banana Bro to win. It's possible. He's got pretty good uh, health. No, he doesn't. Germa's dump truck ass is coming in here. At number 29. So who's 30? Who have we not seen yet? Seaman. Oh, shit. It is Seaman. Oh, Gimli. This ring is full of just memes right now. If I had to put a bet down, I'd put, I would put it right now on... Mm, well, wait, I will wait for the last one. I don't think it's going to be Glue Man. He's been in here for too long. Look at his health. It's going to be Dump Truck. Just watch. Or Nancy Drew. Wait, is Catboy regening health? Yeah. Banana Bro gone. Final competitor is Seaman at number 30. Here is one of your winners in the ring right now. Cheers to you, CD. Glue Man. Germa Dump Truck. Nancy Drew. Forget about Glue Man. It's not your year. It never is. One of these will be crowned. Catboy Germa has been eliminated by Fortnite Jimmy. <laughs> Fortnite Jimmy has gone nuts. I actually, I think I might change my vote here. I think I'm putting it on Fortnite Jimmy. If Beanbag Sonic didn't eliminate himself, I... <laughs> Dude, come on. All right, uh, I think it, it could. I think it's gonna be Nancy Drew. Dump truck, Seaman. Cheers to you, Murius. One of these will be the other winner. If Seaman wins, then that that's stupid. He just comes in at thirty. Nancy Drew cannot let that happen. Oh no. Okay. Get rid of Seaman. Get rid of Seaman. There you go. Work together. Oh, work together. What are we doing? He's got the most health. Well, Dump Truck actually has a lot of health. Holy shit! He just completely... He completely took him off guard. He wasn't even ready. He wasn't even ready. Oh my god. Oh no! Nancy Drew and Dump Truck are the last two. Who will win the encore? I got my money on Nancy Drew. It's gonna be Nancy Drew. This is it. This is gonna be the end. She's gonna dump him. She's gonna dump him over. It's over. That's it! Nancy Drew is your winner! Of the 2020 Encore Rumble. Nancy Drew is your winner. Here is your winner, the <laughs> superstar. Dumped the truck. Now it's Nancy versus Juggles for the real winner. That sounds like a good idea to me. What are the rules? Congratulations, uh, congratulations, Nancy Drew. Put him in a cage. And this is a bet. This is going to be a big bet, guys. Here comes a big prediction. Put him in a cage match. Hell in a Cell. Okay.
Put him in a hell in a cell. Nancy Drew coming in. Versus uh, Juggles. Nancy Drew seems to have the advantage. Select Arena. Sure, why not? In a rundown high school gym. Here comes the... So, I mean, you can... This is probably going to last a little while. Hell in a Cell. This determines the real victor. The real champion of German Rumble 2020. Are predictions live right now? They are. This is a big one. Go to match options. No, we're not doing big head mode. You went all in? All right. Do big head mode. Do it. We can't do big head mode. Not right now. <laughs> no big head mode. No, this is the championship. <clears throat> Thirty six million on who? What do you got? You get this is a major, major difference here. Sixty eight percent of you guys are putting all your money on Nancy Drew. Okay. See if you guys are right. Uh, I'm gonna get started now. Let me bet. Well, you got to bet right now. You got to use channel points, man. It's closed. Let's go. Here comes the champion of the 2020 Rumble. Nancy Drew or Juggles the Great. Main event. Hell in a Cell in a random rundown high school. Nice start by Nancy Drew. Didn't even wait a second. Kind of hard to see through this cage, though. Underdog? <laughs> Uh-oh. How do you win a Hell in a Cell? You have to pin, right? I would laugh so hard if that was it. I would fucking shit my pants if that was seriously how it ended. Oh, man. Nancy Drew even has better stats. It doesn't matter sometimes. Momentum is all that matters. There we go. Nice reversal. Switching it up a little bit here. What? What? The silence is deafening. <laughs> yeah. It's just like, you know, these two people are kind of just throwing around. They're kind of just moving their bodies around and like landing on their backs. Health is not that big of a deal, though. This is depressing. <laughs> Quite the main event. Yeah, let's go. Get him. Oh, uh, oh! Why is there even a referee in here? Why is there a referee in here? <laughs> that would not even hurt. You just landed on your back while holding his legs. <laughs> Going for the pin. Is it possible? Will they use the cage? Somebody get up on top of the cage. Oof. Get on top of the cage. Somebody climb the cage. <laughs> it 
it really is so depressing without like fans and like sounds besides <laughs> on the undertale ost i think this is it for nancy drew by the way this is it yeah that's it slap in the belly you know he sees victory Juggles has the momentum, though. No. That could be it. One. No, one count. She just did the Undertaker recovery. Come on, Nancy. Into the cell. Not, I guess, not strong enough to knock him. Oh. 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 Not good. Not good for Nancy Drew. No. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> that can't be how it ends. <laughs> oh, this is so dumb. Nancy, fight back. <clears throat> fight back, Nancy. Fight back. One, two, no, that's it. Juggles the Great ends up winning and ends up taking the crown for actual Jerma Rumble 2020 winner. Oh, that, what an upset. 70% of you guys got it wrong. That's it. <laughs> that was, the, it was like the weird dog crawl. He is a superstar. Juggles the Great, congratulations. <laughs> oh, man. Do a best out of three? No, no, no best out of three. Worst character? What? Juggles is a great character. How about Super Juggles versus Super Nancy Drew? <laughs> no. <laughs> I want to talk about this for just a second. Uh, so you probably noticed that the awards this year, there was a lot more categories to put uh, nominations in. But you didn't see a bunch of those categories. There was like another eight or nine categories that uh, were not added to this particular stream. And the reason why is... It was going to be, like, too much to do. I didn't want to put a bunch of that on the editor and editors to make, like, 30-plus videos. So what we're going to do is stalling. What? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm describing what we're going to do. We're going to do an encore awards night that are the sort of extra categories. That's probably not going to happen for a little while because I want people to be able to vote on it. So I would assume probably in the next like week or two, we'll do a sort of like little encore uh, for like an hour or so. And we'll just do the other ones. Not like as flashy or anything. Uh, we, we might not even need videos for it. It'll be just fun to kind of look at it, though. We'll see. Give us back our points. <laughs> Give us back the points. I kind of like the idea. Hold on. Let's do. Let me see. I kind of want to. I want to see some more. So you can do like a custom match. Oh, wait. No, you can't. Didn't they add something? No. I want to do a table match. Who's like the strongest in here? I want to do a f no, not Fortnite Jimmy. No, that no, no, no. We're, we're getting away from Fortnite Jimmy. Well, you want Catboy Germa versus me? Okay, we'll do that. Catboy Germa versus Germa nine eight five. 
Oh, no, no, no. Uh, against McDLT. That's a good idea. 100 fucking stats. <clears throat> okay, so. No, against me. I, but I mean, McDLT is my favorite character. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. But look, I'm so terrible. I'm still gonna win. <laughs> Cat boy German in all capitals, by the way. <clears throat> Bets? You want to do bets? Let's go. Go for it. Let's do another prediction. Catboy Germa versus German 985. I mean, you saw the stats. This is going to be an absolute shit show. I lost everything. <laughs> oh, no. You lost everything? <clears throat> With Nancy Drew. We said that with Nancy Drew. That's right. I could just come back here. And by the way, it's if you get broken through a table. You just have to go through the table. There's no pinning. Just whoever goes through it first. Twenty twenty one. Yeah, we we, I, we were in the right in the middle of the rumble, but happy new year, guys. Uh, I know that this year has like sucked. For uh, many reasons. Let's really hope that 2021 is better. Off, let's put it off to a good start, you know what I mean? Because shit was rough. It was really rough in 2020. Catboy Germa is going to win every time. You have to you have to cosplay as Catboy Germa if he wins. I have to cosplay as Cat Boy Germa if he if they win. Um, I'm going up against my like broken, wrapped up body cast character. What? Oh, hold on a second there. Wait a minute. Let's make this interesting. Why don't we make this interesting? Why don't we? So, if. If Catboy Germa wins, I will dress up like a Catboy. Okay. If Germa985 wins, you shave a billion dollars off that fucking debt. I want a billion off that debt. Deal? Deal? Got a deal. We got a deal. Okay. Oh, I'm fucking ready for this one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Jeremy. Three, two, one. Do not lose this fucking match. No, no, no. Don't restart. Let's go. I don't want to dress up as Catboy Jerma. Good start, Jerma 985. Shave a billion off this debt, for the love of God. Good start. Good start. Very good start. Just th throw him around the ring. Just toss him outside. Toss him outside. Toss him. Smash him through the table right now. Cheating. What do you mean cheating? I don't, I'm not cheating. You saw the stats. <laughs> through the table right now, please. Through the table right now. Oh my god. I am destroying. Oh! Right into the chest. This weak point. The sensitive spot. Oh shit. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it.
cat boy. I mean, that was a cat boy. I just hissed. I, I just hissed in cat boy German's face. Oh, look at me. Oh, my goodness. I'm going for it. That's me saying I'm going for it. Whatever it is. <laughs> Holy shit. I... No, 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 you, you're doing fine. You're doing okay. You're going to be just fine. Just over through the table. Not much health left from Catboy. Get that table, Germo. Get it in here. Do not have this blow back in your face. That's not what should be happening right now. Okay, whatever. Set that table up. And one of you... When I say one of you, I mean me. Jeez. <laughs> Catboy redemption incoming? No, I hope not. I really don't want to dress up as Catboy Germa on stream. Going for the table. Oh, shit. 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 Reverse it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. That was a double reversal. Double reversal. Okay. Get... What are you... What are you doing? What are you doing? Do not. Get up and fight. Get up and fight. Nice reversal. This is it. Through the table. Do it. Power bomb. Suplex. Suplex through the table. Please. Do something. What are you doing? You fucking idiot. Oh my god. Just roll off the table. Good, 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 good. Right in the gut, right in the gut. Again, again, do it again. Onto the table. What? You didn't put him on? Put him on the table. Put him on the table. Do it. Do it good. Very good. This is it. This is it, right? This is it. This is it. I'm gonna win. I win. <laughs> Take a billion dollars off that debt right now. Take a billion dollars off right now. Bang, 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 bang. I win, I win, I win, I win, I win. That's one billion dollars. Ooh, and I, I put a lot up for that one. <laughs> I put a lot up. I was going to dress up like German Catboy on stream. The entire thing. The whole thing. Double or nothing. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Double or nothing. What do you mean? How does that work? Two billion off the debt, or I have to stream two days in a row as Derma Catboy. Catboy for a year. That's not happening. It's not worth it. No, I'm not doing it. It's not worth it. I know. It. No, I'm sorry. I just I just tapped you a little bit. I'm not doing that. I know when to stop. That's it. Shave it off. <laughs> not doing it. That's two. Nope. I win. So many. 50 million points. Oh my god. Double or nothing to wipe the whole thing. Oh, I don't know about that. <clears throat> Are you kidding me? <clears throat> to wipe the whole thing? The debt is clear. If I win here. 
Can I call in a wild card? Does it have to be German 985? Or can I call in a, can I phone a friend here? No, it has to be me. Let's go. This is for all the marvels right here. <laughs> it's ha it's me. It is me. Go and have to be it has to be at this high school arena. No deal, no deal. What do you mean, no deal? We're gonna have to pull this? Okay, all right, fine, 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 fine. We'll pull it. Remember, this is two Catboy streams in a row. Back to back. So this is, so this, uh, it's just, is this deal or no deal? This is, if I win, the debt is cleared. If I lose, I have to be German Catboy for two days straight. Let's go. Let's see what the people want. Okay. This is looking pretty unanimous. This is looking pretty unanimous to me. <clears throat> Either we put an end to the debt arc or we win. <laughs> it's true. 2020, we could put a close on it right now, or it might bleed into 2021 and I have to dress up as a cat person. Uh, I don't think you guys really lose here. It is set in stone. Is the deal? Is the deal? That's it. Sixty-seven percent of the vote. It's over. This is either all in. This is either two streams in a row. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> go. 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 Predictions. Oh, I, I, I didn't know we were doing predictions for this one. Careful on your betting. Fuck. Okay, right off the bat, not good. Just go get a weapon. Just go. It's an extreme rules match. Go get a, a knife and just start stabbing Catboy. Just go back there and go grab a, a bag of trash and do the Danny DeVito. Oh my god, it can't end like this. Go get a weapon. You can take the, the health down very quickly. Reversal. Oh, fucking Jesus. Don't even. Up, 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 up. Come on. Momentum. Momentum. You idiot. Oh, my God. How'd you miss? It was point blank punch. You missed a point blank punch. Don't do a flashy move off the top turnbuckle. It's not going to do anything. You're not going to have time to do this. They're going to reverse it. It's a pretty big deal, though. That was a big move. Go get a weapon. So much riding on this. This might be the biggest bet of my online career. What am I doing? Cat, the, the cat boy's health is not going down. <laughs> Get something big. Get so, okay, a bat. Good, good. Right in the fucking head. Right in the head. Yep, go on, come on. Clear this shit. Clear this dead beat, beat with a bat. No! Get up. Get the bat. Oh. 
Nice. Pick up the bat. You're so much weaker than Catboy Germa. Pick the bat up. Pick up the bat. You idiot. You're just being so stupid. Pick the bat up. Oh, man. Reverse. No. <laughs> Get up. Get up. <laughs> Why are his armpits exposed? I don't know, dude. <laughs> Get the bat and hit him. No, please do not hit him. Run. Run away. Just run. Right in the head. Quick. Good. Good, good, good. Again, again, again. What are you doing? <laughs> that was a pretty good comedy routine. It's still anybody's game right now. The health is pretty comparable. It's not a blowout in either direction. That's a big move. Pick up the bat. Forget about taunting. Finish it. Finish it. Finish it. Finish this. Nice. All right, pin, 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 clear it. Clear the debt. Once and for all, do it. Cat boy, he sucks. Um, don't speak so soon. Oh, no. Good dodge. Steal it. Steal it, steal it, steal it, steal it, steal it. Good, 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 good. <laughs> oh, shit. Get up, please. Oh, thank God. Thank God. No! <laughs> Fuck! Get up! Get up! It can't be! You're gonna get out! Oh no! Oh, no! 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 Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Who the fuck said that? Who the fuck said that for me to do that? Who said that? I'm very upset with you. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ. Here is your winner. Oh, my God. I, I, can't, I can't catch a break here. Career's over. I... I, I For two streams in a row, too. I don't want to do that. I can't believe I lost again. See you in 2021, guys. Where Catboy Germa becomes uh, a real. Shit. Well, I'll have to figure that out. And that's probably where I'm going to end the stream for tonight. I think that's a pretty good place to stop. Oh. That was, uh, that was a lot of fun. Thanks again to all the mods that really made that possible. Because this shit was not going to be possible without them. And thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully, 2021 is better than 2020 was. Put on the fedora hat. Yeah, I'll, no, I'll, get, I'll get on cam. I'll get on cam. <clears throat> I'll get on cam. We'll put the fedora hat on. I took my... Let me turn this off. It's cat boy time. I don't have... I don't have the cat boy materials here. You think I'm going to do that? How am I going to do that? I can't do that. Loud.
game. All right, let's turn the camera back on. Can you see me? Why is it so bright? Uh, hi, happy new year. Um, 2020 was kind of difficult. I, I know a lot of you know that I took like three months off. Uh, because I had like the medical problem stuff. And, um, obviously the pandemic was really, really fucking annoying and horrible. It's still going on too. Uh, so I really, really hope that 2021 can just bring so much more happiness to people. Because 2020's brought a lot of shitty times. So, uh, thank you everybody for making at least the 2020 for me fun. Uh, I've had a great time when I've been able to stream, when I've come on streams and everything, so... Um, it's a bright spot for me, so, uh, thank you. Uh, I'll see you guys next year. It's already next year for some of you. It's not, I gotta wait for PST, though. P I, I'm not gonna, like, not for two hours, but, um, 2021 will have, there's a lot of streams that I was gonna do in 2020 that are gonna happen in 2021. Uh, the baseball stream, a couple of secret ones that I can't talk about. There's at least two or three of them that are just ready to go, uh, and I'm, Excited to try them, try to, uh, to try to do something and try to have fun. Uh, there were a lot of subs tonight. Um, too many for me to even, I just, I wasn't, I couldn't even keep up with them. Uh, the channel is just about to cross, it's, it's all time high. It's almost at 12,000 subs on the channel, which is fucking unbelievable. I never thought I would ever deserve something like this. I sometimes don't think I do. And I'm just really happy that you guys think this is fun. Uh, it's a lot of fucking people. It's a lot of subscriptions and I'm just happy that you think it's fun. No one's ever obligated to give any money. I don't read donations anymore. So you don't have to give me any money if you don't want to. But it's, it's been wild. And uh, on top of that, I hope I can spend the money that you are giving me in, in a good place. I hope I'm, I hope I'm doing the good things with it, I hope. He, oh, and, and, and just like that, he goes into the telephone booth and he becomes the Redditor. Fat, types faster than a speeding bullet, arguing with people online. This is a hundred community subs. Holy shit, dude. That's too many. Too, that's too many. That's a hundred from John Cena. I can't even read them all. I, I'm... Use it to buy the Catboy costume. A Catboy costume is like from the dollar store. It's like $2 for like the ears. And then I just need to get like a skirt and a... And a collar. And fishnets. Oh no, I'm in trouble. I'm in a lot of fucking trouble. Buy a quality one, you bitch. Quality what? A quality collar? This is going to haunt me for the rest of my life. You know, this is going to follow me forever. Remember I told you that that like germa sus face? I was like, I hate that face. And and they, you turned it into a meme. I had nothing to do with that one. I just said I didn't like the face, and you made one e you made one way more popular and way more spammable. I was gonna like no, that'd be worse face. Um oh, let me hold on a second. Uh but anyways, yeah, I Well fucking impo whatever. I kinda like this. I like this look without this here. Wayne the Rock just lob just gave 50 community subs. It's too that's too much money to give me. That's an insane amount of subscriptions. Catboy made, that was not part of the deal. It was not Catboy made, it was just simply Catboy. Not part of the deal. Are you trying to tack stuff on and not going to work that way. I want you to see this. There we go. Happy New Year. The Rock in chat. Holy shit. 
Uh, but yeah, thanks guys. Let's let's go for twenty twenty one. Over the next few months, let's hope the world kind of can start to heal a little and get back to normal. I hope so. I don't know. I don't have a crystal ball, but it's gonna do the best I can because that's all I know how to do. And that's it. So, much love to all of you. Happy New Year. Uh, we're not in PST yet, but for Eastern time. Thanks a lot, guys. Uh, we can go somewhere. Let's let's raid somebody. It's New Year's Eve. Who's on PST that's still streaming right now? You got to catch like a second ball drop. Who's on PST? Is, is Neander's is on PST? Is she? Omega lol again. <laughs> we no, we do we did we did just raid Neander's. Who else is on PST? Oh, you know where I could send you guys? Yeah, I could send you to I could send you guys to uh, to Ross, Rubber Ninja. Yeah, I think he's he's on PST, right? Twenty twenty one New Year's VR party. Oh shit! All right, all right. Give a shit. I'm not gonna read that. You're not gonna get one guy moment right off the bat in twenty twenty one. Not gonna happen. Uh, yeah, we'll we'll, we'll go to we'll go to Rubber Ninja. VR party. What's, I was sending you to Nanner, uh, Nanners, but uh, I'm going to say Nanners. <laughs> uh, you know, that guy Nanners. Um, yeah, I would send it. We, we, we'll, hey, I, we, we, we jump around with our raids here. We jump around with our raids. I look big, don't I? Don't I? Don't I? Wouldn't you be scared of this guy if he was run, running up to you? That's, I, I have pants on. Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, yeah, say hello to uh, Rubber Ninja for me. Happy New Year, everybody. We'll see you. I'm probably not streaming tomorrow. I'll be back on the second. So we'll do like two, three, four, and we'll go from there. So see you when I, I see you, Catboy Germa 2021. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, good night, guys. We're going to do the uh, credits first just because I want to see how fast it's going to roll because it's going to be fucking crazy. So let's take a look. Here come the credits. Laser like speed. That's insane. <laughs> That's fucking ridiculous. We're not even through the bees. That's the fastest it's ever been. I really think it might be. There's been a couple times it came close. Last year, uh, New Year's Eve came, or yeah, a year ago, came pretty close too. To being just that fast. You guys just spoil the absolute shit out of me. Um, I'm forever grateful. I want to give a very special shout out to all the mods I mentioned previously. Like Crow Skinale, uh Leather Jacket. Cad. Grump. Clump. VR Josh. They did so much work. And they helped out so fucking much for this stream. So... And uh, my manager, Jake, you guys know, remember Jake, good dude, helped out a lot, carnival producer, you guys know. And uh, also the uh, Super Daza too, for just absolutely burning out 19 videos. And there was a lot of other support too. It's just like thanks because it would it, it could not have happened without them. So thanks, guys. And you shout out my cat. What's your cat's name? Hola. Hey, Ola? 
Thanks for watching the stream. Hope you have a good 2021. Oh, I got to get into the... I, I, I need to start learning cat, right? I don't even know how this works. I don't even know what the meme is. I have no idea. Happy, happy new year, everybody. We'll see you soon. Thanks for spending your New Year's with me, of, of all people. I'm honored that you would spend it here. Take care of yourselves. Let's hope 2021's better. Much love to you all. And I'm going to send you guys now. We're going to send you to uh, Rubber Ninja. Good night, everybody. See you in a day or two. Thank you for participating. And good night.